live from New Jersey, our first uh, live on Zoom, Holistic Health and Craft Fair. I'm so excited. My name is Siobhan, and I'm with Dr. C.J. Rhodes, who uh, is uh, volunteering her precious time to help us with today's event. So we have a lot of vendors. Um, I will be introducing the different vendors and I'm going to share um, my screen. Make sure that you can um, all see the screen. We, we can. Okay, hold on one second. So we, we have a list of many speakers today from 1 to uh, 4.30. And throughout the program, I will be going through the list so you can have their contact information. Uh, some are having specials. I would ask any attendee, any non-vendor, to please mute themselves. And if you have a question throughout the program, feel free to chat. We'll do our best to answer questions as they come up. Um, I, because I'm waiting for people to come on board, I decided I would introduce myself during this time while people are waiting. Um, I have a holistic health practice that's both online and in person, and I offer many different uh, classes. And let me just show you some of those uh, classes. Some help with physical uh, balance, uh, and emotional balance. We have um, Tai Chi and uh, Qigong, and these are all gentle movements. And then we also offer uh, special classes such as how to relieve pain with energy medicine, balancing uh, hormones nat uh, naturally, uh, how to cope with stress, stress and anxiety. Um, we have a Monday and Wednesday morning class, uh, which helps to tap into your body's natural healing ability. That's called Holistic Health with Siobhan. And on Wednesday evenings, um, Tai Chi Cha, which is gentle movements that helps with stress and a lot of other health challenges. And so all of these can be um, found on our website. Uh, let me just go back here. Um, you can see our website, our telephone number is here, 609-752-1048, and our website. And if we can answer any of anybody's questions throughout the program, um, again, you can use the chat. So I'm going to stop sharing my screen now. Okay, did the stop share happen? There we go. Okay, good. Um, so CJ, would you like to introduce yourself? And we'll, we'll introduce you later on in the program as well. But um, before Mariana uh, comes on, would you like to introduce yourself? And thank you so much for donating your time today to help us with the program. No problem. Hi, I'm CJ Rhodes. I'm, uh, I'm the um, direct, uh, managing director of an organization called Health, Prosperity, and Leadership Institute. Um, Siobhan is one of our partners um, and, and board member and highly active volunteer. She helps us with the World Tai Chi Day and a whole bunch of other really wonderful programs. Um, I'm also a professor at Kutztown University and um, run a uh, and developing technologies for nonprofit organizations, especially those in the health, prosperity, and leadership fields. Um, I'm, I've been a, a, a long time um, uh, participant in the in the in-person holistic fairs that Siobhan has been putting up, um, um, you running, um, but this is the first time we've had the chance to do it online, so I hope you all enjoy, your, enjoy it. CJ, um, I would just like to uh, thank you so much for that, uh, CJ. I would like you to uh, know that one of our vendors uh, said that the Zoom is saying the holistic link is incorrect. 
Um, so I don't, I, I, I told them just to go back on. I went, <clears throat> I went on right from the link. It seemed to work. Yeah. yeah I, it, a lot of times what happens is the link gets broken in email. And so they click on it and it's not the full link. It's only half of it. And so it's uh, not work. So they, that's why we included the meeting ID and password. So if the link doesn't work, they can just go to zoom.us and type in the meeting ID and the password and they'll be able to get in. Perfect. Okay, so um, I'm, I'm just so everyone knows, I am the, I'm, I'm acting as the back end host. Siobhan is the front end host. I'm the back end host. Host. So most of the time, my video will be off. Um, and if you have any issues or questions or problems, you just go to chat. You can type them in. I'll be watching that to see if there's anything that needs to be done. When I see a speaker who has come on, I put the word speaker in front of their name so that Siobhan and I can more easily see who are the speakers from the participants. Because when it's time for you to be a participant, I will be highlighting. Uh, the, the speaker I meant, the, the, I will be highlighting the speaker. So you'll get big on the screen um, for everyone when you are speaking, just like I, I should be big on the screen right now. And in a moment, if Siobhan's back, Siobhan will be big on the screen. <laughs> yes, uh, CJ, why don't we take this time to tell everybody about our exciting summit on January 16th. We have two very provocative speakers. Uh, would you like to tell us about that? Sure. On January 16th, we have Dr. Peter Wayne um, of Me Harvard Medical Center. Um, he's the director of the Osher Center, which is the Integrative Healthcare Center of Harvard Medical School. And Dr. Richard Schlam, and I can never pronounce his name. Um, I, I'm not ready. But how do you pronounce his name, Siobhan? Schlamag? Schlam we're just going to say a neurobiologist. He's a neurobi He's a neurobiologist uh, and uh, the head of his own institute for integrative health. Um, Dr. Wayne and and uh, I'll just call him. We'll say Peter and Richard. Peter and Richard have known each other for many years, and they have differences of opinion on things like chi and what the science involved in health is all about um, but they are good friends and so what they're going to do is they're going to have a discussion online discussion about um, chi and the science of health and integrative medicine and you know just basically that it's going to start at two o'clock eastern time yes. on january 16th um, and you have to register because you only get the Zoom link if you register. So if you're interested in that at all, please feel free to go to worldtaichiday.org and register. Um, or, you know, if you've got an email, I've, I've sent out some emails and so has uh, um, Siobhan and uh, uh, World Tai Chi Day. Um, or you can just go to worldtaichiday.org and the registration link is right there on the front page. Um, and you just need to give us your information and then the day before the event, we will send out the Zoom link so that you'll be able to get one. So CJ, um, in a nutshell, this is talking about something very um, esoteric, something not really tangible. Can you measure? Can you um, see chi? Can chi work on the body? Can you manipulate chi? Um, it's all the questions that energy workers um, get asked. How do you know it's there? And is there the science behind what I call the foo-foo? And I'm, 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 spoiler alert, CJ and I disagree. I say there is, and CJ says there is not. And I never said that. I said okay. we have to, we, 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 uh, there is, to, from my perspective, there's a limit. The science has given us a limit as to yes. what, how how and what chi yes. is measurable exactly. um, and i don't believe that you can emit chi through the air that's just one well, thing that's i don't where we, there's that's no science where we disagree it. that's where we disagree right. so it won't be between cj and i it'll be between these two scientists and we're very <laughs> excited about that program and i hope you'll all join us okay so i'm ready to rock and roll mariana i i already see your you're sipping into the brew. 
So we're going to switch now to our first speaker and a friend of mine, uh, Mariana Foreman with the beautiful hat. So we're going to spotlight uh, Mariana now. <clears throat> wow, there was no voice there. Uh -oh. Hi, look, now you can really see the hat. It's so cool. It's like it has little earrings. So first I want to thank Siobhan and CJ for doing this. I think it's awesome to be able to have a live event to showcase what we talk about, what we do, and showcase our products. So thank you very much. And um, my name is Mariana Fierro Foreman. You can find me on Facebook at Healing Sense, VIP group T Talk. And what my goal there is, is to take my knowledge of teas, aromatherapy, I am a certified aromatherapy, and, um, and herbs, and teach you how to make a healthier lifestyle for you without really giving much up. Okay, so here is what I am drinking right now, and by any means, other than being green, because we all know it's not easy to be green, right? But other than being green, doesn't that look phenomenal? And you can top it with shavings and... It looks nice and frothy. And Mariana, you already received someone on chat saying they love their Sipology tea press. So, uh, well, get yeah, oh, the tea press is awesome. We also have a personal tea press now, too, that you can take with you whenever you want. But my frother is what made this look so beautifully frothed. And Mariana, and we have a question what, what tea is that that you're working with? And Marie, I'm so glad you got on. I am going to, that's exactly what I'm going to say, because here we go. Does this look at all like it would be healthy, right? It looks like something you'd really enjoy. And what it is, is it's actually sweet chocolate matcha, which it comes in our big packages. And it only has five calories and zero sugar in it. Not what you would get at a barista, because that would be loaded with sugar and carbs. Tastes just as good, if not better. You can personalize it. It took me about once the water was boiled, like maybe less than a minute to make, and since it has matcha, which is a green tea on steroids, it's about 10 times the antioxidants of regular green tea. It also has L-theanine in it and um, tryptophan to help give you a focused level energy for about three to six hours. And even if you want to boost that up, and you know, I am a big energy drink um, no on that, no energy drinks. The energy drinks are so bad for you. But if you take your matcha and you put it in like two to four ounces of water, which normally it's an eight ounce serving, and you have a shot of matcha, you get that same energy, but you get it all naturally and your body reacts much better to it. No crashing, no stomach nervousness, um, or no crashing jitters. So matcha is the way to go. And I have to tell you, we have some phenomenal flavors. I, I don't think I've ever gone through a bag of matcha as fast as I have the sweet cinnamon. It just, I put it on pumpkin pie, like on the whipped cream. All right, so much for calories, right? But I do, I've even mixed matcha and whipped cream. Oh, I can't uh, see. Wait, hold on. We have a question. Um, are you, is this a hot drink? It appears to be a cold drink, somebody's asking. This is cold, but it tastes just as good hot because you can have a hot or cold latte because that's really what I made out of it is a latte with also our biodegradable straw, because Sipology as a company is very um, conscious of the environment and part of the tea, ethnical tea partnership. So they're very conscious about the workers. Um, it's, a, it's a really, really great company. No irradiated ingredients, no MSG, um, all natural ingredients. And we are a Canadian company, so all natural ingredients there is a little bit, they can, you can't sneak anything in there. It's the essence of the plants, the oils, and and things like that. There is no, um, I don't want to say that. There's just nothing unnatural about them. So, and the facilities are organic. So it's a lot of fun. Mariana, where can, where can people find you? Where, where can we, and where can we sample some of this tea? Well, sampling is very hard, especially right now, because outdoor events aren't that big. But I will be with the growers market in Columbus um, when they come back in the spring, hopefully by then, because we do do in-home um, taste testing. And I do right now a lot of virtual stuff, kind of like this. So if anybody's interested in that, we could do a matcha day, a healthy day. We have a medicinal line of teas called Heal Thyself, 
which is certified by the Canadian government as medicinal, and this is our only bagged tea. Everything else is loose leaf. And the reason this is bagged is because it is a dose of medicine. Um, it comes with, you know, some medication and contraindications, so you need to kind of just check the profile on it. But I am at Healing Sense. I am at mariana2180 at gmail.com, which is a great place to reach me. Um, the website is www.sipology.com backslash M-F-T-E-A dash R-I-F-F-I-C. That's a lot to write down, I know. Mar Mariana, I will, uh, yes. Uh, Carol, um, the Columbus Growers uh, Market or Organic Market, I call it the Organic Market, is in Columbus, New Jersey at the Columbus Farmers uh, Market. It's, uh, but the, are, are they, can you write the web, website yeah. here in chat? Yes, when Mariana is, is finished speaking, she'll go to chat and she'll write her um, contact information. However, um, I will also uh, share my screen um, throughout the program so that you can see everybody's contact information uh, throughout the program. So I'm just trying to go down here a little bit for Mariana. Thank you. There you go. There's her contact information. Um, Mariana. Sean, um, why don't you copy that and paste it into chat? It'll just take you a second to do that. Oh, okay. Thank you. That is the uh, wonderful voice of CJ. And, uh, uh oh. Um, hold on. Um, okay. So, Mariana, um, I can, as you can see, I can't do two things at the same right. time. Mariana, show them, please. Um, the gift that I um, did the other day for um, a, a secret a secret friend, because I don't want them knowing who it is that I'm giving the gift to. And I appreciate that, but you know what? The reason I didn't show it is, Siobhan, you probably got one of the last sets. They're not available, and I don't want to tease anybody with it because it's a phenomenal set. Oh, um, okay. what, is it too late for them to order it for? That set, yes. There's no more. It was a limited edition. It comes out every Christmas. So if, if you go to my page, Healing Sense, where I not only share recipes um, with tea as far as drinks, but also some food recipes, I also kind of talk about how to incorporate healthy living in small doses in your lifestyle so that you're not trying to make changes all at one time, because usually that doesn't work for people. So if you, I, I don't know if I mentioned them, a certified aromatherapist also. So with the combination of the herbs and the teas and the oils, I can help you be healthier. So we, and I love doing it. We so can contact you as a consultant then on aromatherapy as well as tea. Um, Carol is asking, do you have any white sage tea, and can she get it before the holidays? I don't believe we have white sage. Most of our white teas are fruit-based. I will check and make sure that there's no sage in any of them, but I don't believe we do. And holiday shipping right now is iffy because it's not that we can't get out of the warehouse, but it's more UPS. Okay. I mean, I, I personally have a package in UPS that's been in Pennsylvania for three days. It's traveled the entire state. I think it made it into Ohio too. So it's so hard to guarantee anything right now because UPS is just like insane. So Mariana, so. we have actually one more minute with you. So what is the top thing you want us to remember about Sipology and your practice? That I will work with you within your means to make you the healthiest you can be because I have the products to do it. Sipology teas are great. There's a lot of healthy lines. Of course, I couldn't even touch on all of it here. And oils are great to heal. So with the combination, we can definitely work out a plan for you to be healthier with little changes. And I think that's, for me, the most important change, you know, is to do it so that it's something that the people can absolutely stick to. And again, Healing Sense. Go to Healing Sense on Facebook, S-E-N-S-E. And, and, and um, I, put, I put that in chat, Mariana, and I, awesome. I want to thank you so much. And I also want to uh, 
bring up to people that you also on your Facebook page have delectable recipes with the tea, which is something you don't see in a lot of the uh, tea um, programs out there. So uh, Mariana goes above and beyond. So thank you, Mariana, for joining us. And now we're going thank to you. go right to Joanne. And Joanne is with us, and I'm going to spotlight her. So again, um, uh, thank you, uh, Mariana, and hope to see you. Hi, Joanna. I'm Hi. Gonna... Good morning. Oh, oh, good afternoon. Thank you so much for organizing this. I'm really, really excited to get a chance to connect in person, even if it's virtually. Um, we've been. This has been really. It's been hard on all of us, um, business people, because we love connecting with our communities, and we haven't been able to do that. Right. And Joanna, while you're yes. talking and introducing uh, what you have and showing us what you have, and by the way, do the hair flip because yes. um, the reason, one of my things. I, I mean, Joanna uses her products. So while you're doing that, I'm going to cut and paste your information. Okay. So you start talking and I'll come right back to you. Okay. Okay. Well, Arbonne is all about um, healthy living, um, being healthy, mind, body, and skin and they go above and beyond um, healthy ingredients, clean ingredients, and really until I discovered Arbonne, these are things I didn't really know anything about or think about. Um, some of the products that I have to highlight, well first the shampoo, Siobhan I know you love this. Um, this is one of the 21 products I use today. Um, I use all their hair care, it's sulfate free, those are chemicals that tend to weight down your hair. Um, and make it feel heavy and dull. So the hair care line has shampoo, conditioner, and we also have styling products. Um, skincare really is what made me fall in love with Arbon. As I said, I didn't know anything about ingredients. I never thought about it. I didn't know what a paraben was until I discovered this. So I didn't know why I would want it in my product. That's, so that's beautiful. Now, yeah, this is the new AgeWell line that just came out. I've been using this since mid-September. Um, as you see, it comes in this beautiful box. This line has Bacuchiol. Bacuchiol is a plant-based um, alternative to retinoid, so it's more gentle on your skin. Um, Arbonne's been around for 40 years, so they've always done this. They've always had clean ingredients from the beginning, clean plant-based ingredients. It's really what they were founded on. This line comes in this pretty packaging. Beautiful. You, get, you can get every, purchase everything separately or you can purchase them together. Um, so it's your eye cream, night cream, um, a day cream moisturizer, serum, toner, and a facial cleanser. The facial cleanser is a plastic bottle, but all the rest of these are reusable glass bottles. That's one of the ways that Arbon is becoming even more sustainable. So as part of their Arbon cycle program that they just started this year, I can take all these bottles, put them, save one of my shipping boxes, put all these bottles back in the box and mail them back to Arbon. Wow. And, and so reuse them. Joanna, how can, um, I put your contact information, but is is that particular box product available now? Like if somebody wants yes. to gift themselves, I mean, yes, right? Yes, and, and we have um, we also have a preferred client program, so that saves you if you wanted to purchase something like this and purchase a set, you get a discount on a set. Um, preferred clients. It's $29 for the year. It saves you 20% on all your orders. You get free shipping on qualifying orders and you also get product rewards. So if you were to purchase this set, you're gonna get free shipping. And on your next order, you'll have two months to use it. You can choose a free product from our free product list. If, if somebody runs out of time, do you have some in stock that they could meet you and, and get this right away? I do have a few things in stock, yes. That's that's really good to know. Can you yes. share this? Now, For Joanne, uh, the reason I, I, I love what you do, uh, you know, because they're natural products, 
if right. you really use them yourself. Yes. I noticed a, a big difference in your hair volume uh, yes. when you started using the shampoo, which, yes. which got me to start using the shampoo. Line. Yes. And the um, products for the face are very gentle. I've used mm -hmm. them. They're very gentle, and I've noticed a difference. I mean, you're you're, you're growing younger. Thank you. I'm 51, so I always um, I think that's a testament to our products. Yes, yes. So what else? Like like um, what else can we get from you that we can gift ourselves and gift our BFFs? I like that Arbonne really has everything. As I mentioned, I used. 21 products today so that's my skincare my body care my body wash I used in the shower this morning even my toothpaste I used when I brushed my teeth all my makeup I have on is Arbonne um, for a gift this is a really super cute thing they, um, they even have toothpaste I never knew that toothpaste and, and deodorant and deodorant and what is that that you're holding this is um, a lip and cheek and cheek stain I have it on it's poinsettia color so it's a cute little ornament that you can hang on the tray because as I said, they are all inclusive. So besides the hair care, the skin care, Arbonne has a full makeup line with about 30 shades of lip color, three different foundation options. So there's a mineral powder foundation, um, a liquid foundation, and a CC cream, which is an all-inclusive product that has primer, um, foundation, moisturizer, everything all in one. So sunscreen these and are great have, yeah these are great have, stocking stuffers and you have some in stock that people can get and what about like if somebody wants a gift certificate do you have a gift certificate or any specials going on now we don't do gift certificates there are some products that are limited on sale currently and we have some limited edition holiday products i do have some of them available too can, can you show some, us some things? Yes. I have um, this one I have available that someone could get locally. See, they're really cute. They come in these little bags. So these are that are reusable because they're trying to be green. And these, the tubes are made with post-consumer plastics. So they're made with recycled materials. Is this hand cream? These are all hand creams. So this, this trio set, they're coconut, jasmine, and apricot. I gotta say, ladies, what lady doesn't need hand cream? So right? Could, right. And you could give someone this whole bag in this cute little reusable bag. Right. Or you could separate these. A lot of people do that, like for teacher gifts, they'll get a cute little Christmas mug and they do coffee and cream and they'll put one of these in each mug and wrap them up cute. Oh, do you have any, like, to show us that you've done, or? No, I'm not No, that's all right, general. but that's a cute, cute idea. And, and uh, Joanne, could you give us some pricing, some idea of what, what the pricing would be for some of these things? Sure. Um, these are $18, these little, but these you, these you do have to order. And if you're going to order, I would order today or tomorrow because I know shipping the post office, I'm waiting for things from places that I ordered Black Friday, like right after Thanksgiving. And I know, and, not from Arbonne, but like from all different companies. And, and I know shipping is bad now. Joanne, the products last a long time. I don't know if you yeah. have any of the shampoo or conditioner, but uh, I mean, I think I, I got that from you last fall and I'm still, still yes. using it. That was a special too, in like a big liter pump bottle. Yes. So that lasted like that. The shampoo lasted me like eight months, and I found I don't have to wash my hair as often. Same one thing, here. One thing too, Arbonne also has nutrition products because I know I, I'm watching my time. And right now, what we have limited is this coffee protein, and Arbonne's protein is a pea-based protein. So there's no soy, no gluten, no whey. Um, and something else, we have a bag of protein that's $77 and there's 30 servings. Normally, Wonderful. normally we just have chocolate and vanilla, but right now we have this coffee that's delicious. Okay. So Joanne, we have one minute. What, uh, parting 
Uh, Wisdom, would you like to share with us before you leave us? Um, healthy living is just, it's really all about like integrative everything, like your nutrition, your skincare, everything. So that's something I really, you know, enjoy sharing with Arbon. I'm also available to do live, um, you know, virtual parties. And I do have some skincare samples left. Okay, great. If wants to try I'm, something. I'm going to thank you so much and wish you a happy holiday. Thank we have to. So much. Your contact information is chat. in chat. And I'm looking for um, Brenda. Uh, CJ, I don't know if you're on, on with us. Brenda, Brenda, Brenda. There you are. And thank you again, uh, Joanne. Okay, so you have to unmute yourself and we'll spotlight Brenda. Hello, Brenda. How are you? Oh, we, we're, you're still on mute, dear. We can't hear you. There you go. All right, now can you hear me? Well, it's, it's hard to hear you, Brenda, but we can't wait to see some of your items. Brenda is with Dream Out Loud Creations, and she's, she's moving. Can you uh, hear her? There's a lot of background noise. I'm, at a, I'm vending at a Christmas village. Very so, good. I'll do my best here. Um, I love crystals. Um, I love the metaphysical properties of crystals. Um, I collect them and that got me making jewelry um, and it kind of just took off. It started as a hobby and now I'm retired and this is my retirement my job and my husband helps me out a lot with it. Because the background noise is so loud here, I'm going to take the time, I'm going to switch the camera around and just um, basically, because I'm having a hard time hearing, I'm actually going to just show you um, some of the things that I have here on display. So if you bear with me, let me see if I can get this together. I'm going to switch around now. Wonderful, Brenda. And I'm going to say um, uh, that I still want to purchase that bat necklace. Um, we have to get together and, and figure out how to do that. Um, but I've, I've bought some of your jewelry and it's just wonderful and you're so not oh my goodness oh my goodness and you're so knowledgeable about um this the uh, stones that you work look at that necklace who wouldn't want something as nice as that it's actually vintage glass beads from um aruba aruba they're from aruba the, the glass square beads are from aruba they're uh vintage and then oh, then the that's my favorite vacation spot. Oh, Mariana Foreman, who was on earlier, said she purchased two necklaces, a blue crystal and a moon um, a necklace from you, and just and for a friend. Oh, yes. Hey, I got some tea from her. I love it. I love my, my personal tea press. Um, I have a lot of things. I have bracelets. Look at all the bracelets. Now, uh, Brenda, I find that those are great friendship bracelets. They're great as stocking stuffers and to give to a, a, another girlfriend or male oh, friend. And Kathy Welshman, uh, so great to have you join. Oh, my. Wait, go back. What is that sparkly one? Look at that. So just some like glass beads and some uh, like crystals. So those are a, a matching earrings and bracelet. Can I ask what the cost would be for for that? Um, that for this set is twenty dollars. That's um, only twenty dollars. That is wonderful. I like to make some fun things for the holidays. Like here's another one. Oh, that's gorgeous. Um, somebody's asking if you have any lava bead jewelry. What's it? L lava bead jewelry. You know, the, the lava beads that you can put like aromatherapy on? Well, yes, I actually don't have, uh, hold on a minute. I don't have, um, any here, let me, I got some customers, hold on. I have some chakra bracelets. 
that have some lava beads on them. Okay, that's what they're talking about. Great. I do make a lot of jewelry with lava beads, but I, I'm kind of, as far as some that are made already, I'm kind of out of them. Here's one. Nice. And so you can, uh, can you explain to some people who may not know what, what they can do with the lava beads? Well, the lava beads, you can actually put essential, you put it, you put essential oil on your lava beads and you can carry it around your aromatherapy with you. Um, I, I do make them. So if I do custom jewelry, I repurpose old jewelry. Um, so if there's something specific that you're looking for, whether it be a, a certain color, if it's um, something you want to look for for the metaphysical properties, um, if you are looking for something different, say like this is petrified wood from a, a mine in Germany that is now closed. It's covered in a druzy. Or if you want something different like gray baggage, Oh, sorry, focus. Um, but I, I, I do custom work. I have a lot of things at home. If there's something somebody's looking for in particular, I can send you pictures. I can work with you. Uh, if you're looking for something for the metaphysical properties, I can actually work something out with you. Um, this is all I have made right now. But like I said, there's plenty of other things that I can make. Um, do you, uh, Brenda, I know we're past the Halloween, um, holiday. That's what I want. The bat necklace. Go back. Did you, did you save me one? Uh, if you want this bat, you can have that bat. I'll put it aside. I, I wanted, I wanted the black one, I thought. That's all right. We'll talk later, but that's, isn't that, uh, interesting? If you could just focus on that for a moment. Look at that for Halloween. Look at that. And next to it, to the right of it, the other right, yeah. Oh, look at that with the moon. What kind of stone is that, Brenda? That is bumblebee jasper. Wow. Um, somebody is asking, do you have D-R-U-S-Y, Drusy? What did you say? I'm sorry. I, I, I've never heard of this. Dru Helen is asking, do you have Drusy? D-R-U-S-Y. Is that a stone, Helen? Drusy does appear on a lot of stones. Here's a quartz for some Drusy. Um, just, just Drusy. Let's see, I have one cab. Where it is it? Uh, She's looking, Helen. I have some at home. Let me see. I know there's one cab here somewhere. Hold on. It's somewhere. Okay, that's okay. So while you're looking, um, Brenda, you custom make jewelry. We have your information on the chat. Um, Want to call you or email you? And where are you right now? Um, up at the Chamonix Mall. By the Chamonix Mall at a Christmas village. At the there's a Christmas village at the Chamonix Mall. I never knew that. Okay. DMV. Wonderful. I even have her from her diamonds. Oh, can we see the diamonds? I won't sing, but diamonds are a girl's best friend. All right, let me just get over here out of my way because I have some customers coming that my husband's going to have to take care of. Okay, look at all these. Oh, oh. Want to ask selenite? I have a lot of clients that like to use selenite wands. So my clients who are on look, Brenda has a stockpile of selenite wands and the heart shapes. So we talk about this a lot in the classes that I do, and people are asking me where can I get the selenite, and it comes in different colors, different chakra colors. Well, these are actually um, have been dyed. So you have your white wood and the rest have been dyed. I don't know what they dyed them with, but it doesn't come off. But this is all selenite dyed in your chakra colors. Did you dye them? No, I did not. I bought them from someone like that. How much, 
package like that? I'm sorry. How much is a package of the colored stones? I, I, I do these for 20, but today for anybody who wants one, I'll do it for 15. 15! And then I have selenite wands, some of which are drilled that you can hang. I have oh, selenite yeah. wands. I have square bedded ones. I have circles. I have hearts. I have stars. Wow. Brenda, we Brenda, thank you so much. We gotta jump now, but she's at the Chamonix Mall live and in person, or you can contact her through the chat. Brenda, I want to wish you and your husband a happy holiday and thank you for joining us. We're gonna run to Patricia and thank you again, Brenda. Patricia, I'm gonna put you on the spotlight. Hi guys. Welcome, Patricia. How are you today? Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. Very good. This has been amazing. I've tuned in since the beginning and I love all of the vendors. This would have been so great for everybody to see each other in person and actually have a real event, but we're going to make do. So I'm here to talk to you today about iridology. I don't know if it's anything that anybody has known about, has, has heard, piqued your interest, but what I do is I use iridology as an analysis. The science of iridology is really based on the most complicated tissue of the body, which is the iris. It is an extension of the brain and it connects to every organ, tissue, and gland in the body. So this includes the circulatory system, the gastrointestinal system, the glandular system, the neurological system, the skeletal system, and the urogenital system. And it is not a clean slate at birth. So I work with a lot of children and the best thing is preventative because we get to see genetically what children have been predisposed to. Um, the right eye corresponds to the father's genetics. The left eye corresponds to the mother's genetics. Really? So a, yeah. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yes. So it's not a clean slate. We take a look at what's actually been passed down and the iris is cumulative it's not disparative so we see as we age the things that we kind of go through and doing iridology early on with children sets the stage for prevention so at any stage you can have an iridology analysis i i do it in person and i also do it um via email where you email me the pictures i read them and then i do a either a phone consultation or a video conference you know like this a zoom and we go over the entire body. So I, there are three, there are three types. Blue being lymphatic, brown being hematogenic, and biliary, which is the combination. So I'm going to touch on just a few key points of each one. And if anybody has any questions, feel free to ask me. And I'm going to just talk a little bit about some of the modalities that I have for healing. So Starting with the first, it is lymphatic, and that is your blue iris, so prone to lymph congestion. The respiratory system is prone to sinus problems, allergies, and asthma. Those are some of the typical things that we see in a blue eye, some of the areas of opportunity um, that we tend to work on with blue iris clients. Um, the urinary tract system, so prone to being over acidity due to poor kidney function. So using herbs and healing um, modalities to strengthen the forces of the kidneys. So that way it moves the lymphatic system and you reduce your acidity levels. Also any uh, mucous membranes, so prone to problems with the membranes lining up the lungs, the sinuses, the digestive tract, and the urinary passages. So some of the things I um, recommend for people that have a blue iris are to avoid gluten and dairy as they are very mucus forming. Um, they are indicated as acidic so we tend to use liquid chlorophyll which will alkaline the body and help bring down that acidity and also um, to be very conscientious of food sensitivities because in a blue iris, as I said, they tend to create a lot of mucus and congestion within the body. So we look to work with the client in really being extremely specific to find out what their um, allergies are so that way they can avoid them. Any questions with blue so far? 
I'm, I'm just amazed. Uh, now, what uh, can we just step back for a minute? So, what are these uh, different items that you have in front of you? Um, are, are, are people taking like an oral supplement or something based on your diagnosis? So it's not a diagnostic, it's an analysis. But what we do is I work with several different companies. I only do organic um, food-based supplements. I do not do any synthetics. Um, I work with an organic farm out in Utah that customized and makes herbal protocols from colds to everything. Um, the herbalist has created a, a book with herbal remedies, which he offers. Um, he offers in different packaging. So he can make a capsule form for people. It's 40% less effective, but it is available for people that don't do not like to take liquid and then also in liquid combinations. But if you were battling, um, weak kidneys and also had coughs and colds that were seemed to be a chronic issue you can work on both of them in one bottle so he basically can customize it which is wonderful um so that way you're only taking one supplement and he does it, all of the vitamins and minerals as well so it's nice to be able to basically make your own um multivitamin so that's just what that's just one um that's one way that we use that i utilize and then i also do uh symbiotica which is a company that does all uh vitamins and minerals in liposomal form and also in my cell technology meaning that it's super 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 tiny and it passes the blood brain barrier and it passes digestion so it literally goes into the cells automatically with very little process we we have four more minutes with you so i have to call the next vendor their MIA so would you mind continuing to tell us about your work and I'll, I'll be right back sure definitely Thank okay you. I'm gonna move on to they're not MIA I'm sorry Jeremy is here just go ahead okay <laughs> so on go so I I will take any questions if you want to put it in the comments I can always answer them later but I will just touch on on the products um, Iridology, as I said, I can do via Skype or you can come in. I'm in Staten Island and it is an hour and a half for an iridology reading. Today I'm doing $15 off an iridology analysis. Um, so you can book that through healthbeyondborders.net. I will give you the coupon code um, in the comments or you can just contact me directly at the holistic concierge at gmail.com. Um, if you're interested in customizing any products, maybe there's some things that you're dealing with and you want something that will, one product that will be able to address all of your needs, we can certainly do that. That's a phone consultation. It's 15 minutes to do. There's no charge to do it. Um, and it is a $113 for a 16 ounce, which lasts two plus months. So it's really affordable. Um, it's affordable for um, children. It's half the amount at eight ounces and it's, I believe, $51 or $55. Um, so very, very affordable um, to have organic uh, herbs and also vitamins in one supplement. Do they taste well? Nope, don't taste good. Just saying, just wanted to put it out there. They do not taste good. <laughs> the Symbiotica line um, is vitamins and minerals and they taste amazing um it's a company that i found because i deal with so many children and it was very hard to get children to utilize herbs because of the taste they're, they're just not palatable for a little kitties so um symbiotica does a wonderful line um that suits the needs of children and are just absolutely amazing so everything is 15 percent off from Symbiotica, and then also from my farm products, and I do um, EMF through Altera, which is EMF protection neutralizing for the home and also for all of your Wi-Fi um, and electronic devices. And we can talk, that's a whole nother topic we can talk about. Patricia, I find this fascinating. I, I vaguely remember learning about this years ago. Um, I haven't heard about it recently, and I find this fascinating. So you really can tell just by looking at the irises what's going on. And uh, 
I can't wait to know because I have like hazel eyes, kind of brown and yellow, a mixture. So I, I would love to know and compare it to what I understand about traditional Chinese medicine to see uh, how they intersect and the connections. Because I, I bet you uh, similar, it would be similar. So I would love to talk to you at another time. Um, we're, we're ready for our next speaker. And I thank you so much, uh, Patricia. Your information is on the chat. I hope people call you and thank you for joining us. It was great to meet you. Thank you. Thank you. Too. Okay, bye-bye. Alrighty, so I'm looking for Robin. Um, and Robin, uh, there you are. Oh my goodness, Robin. Robin, I got so, I'm going to unmute you. Can you unmute yourself, Robin? We, we can't hear you, Robin. You have to unmute yourself. Yeah, I am. Hi. Oh, Robin, <laughs> I got so nervous. I, I jumped off the other uh, speaker because I couldn't find you, so I'm so glad you joined us. Oh, I'm sorry. I have my cup, I have my cup showing. Um, so you know I was there. Aren't you, aren't I was on a, I was on another meeting until 12:30. So I was yes. trying to get everything. I set thought up. you were live vending somewhere. Listen, I was supposed to be live vending and um they canceled the event because of the restrictions that they're having in the state right now. Oh my goodness. So, so tell us tell us what you do. I'm so excited. I want to I want to see what you do and hear about what you do. You're you're with Row Beans. Robins. Robins is a mobile coffee co company. So we we do um, mobile coffee and desserts. Uh, we'll come to any event. Um, right. We were doing the Asbury Park um, uh, Fresh Market. Uh, we were out there doing the. Um, we were one of the vendors at, at the event. So we were setting up. We set up our, our espresso machine. I'm going to have my son do a, do a little demonstration in a minute. Uh, we have an. Uh, we set up uh, for any event, like we would, we were at the Asbury Park Music Festival. We set up our truck there. We sell desserts, uh, coffees, espressos, uh, anything to do with coffee. Um, my journey with coffee started um, because I was having problems. I was having problems with, uh, and I was thinking this holistic, how does coffee fall into holistic um, medicine? <laughs> it's medicine for me. but. <laughs> I was having problems with my um, stomach. Um, well, I, I found out it was my stomach, but I was having problems with uh, reflux. You know, I didn't know it was reflux, but um, for a few months I would wake up, you know, my heart palpitating, and I'd run to the emergency room, so I'm thinking I'm having a heart attack. And um, only to find out they said nothing wrong. They put me on the EKG machine, all kinds of things, and, um, and they would never find anything wrong with me. And then the last time, that I, it happened to me, my doctor um, admitted me into the hospital and did all these, this whole round of tests, cardiac te things. And then to find out they did an, uh, an endo endoscopy and found out my stomach lining was irritated. Now I love coffee, but I was drinking coffee from, um, out of the can, off the shelf. You know, and, and in the interim, I had found a roaster, one of the, I live in Asbury Park and this young lady had opened up her business. So I started going over to her and I was talking to her about, you know, my issues and I love coffee and I didn't want to give it up. So we were trying different things, different blends and everything. So I came up with a blend that worked for me. I was able to still drink coffee because that's one of the things the doctor took off my list. Coffee, chocolate, all these things. Um, tomatoes, peppermints, all the stuff I love. And uh, they took those things off of, off of my, um, out of my diet. And, um, and I wanted to put them back in. <laughs> so I spoke with this young lady and we came up with this blend of coffee that um, really worked for me. It would it, just enough to wake me up, but wouldn't make me jittery at fabulous taste. So um, I started, Certain, like I have coffee clutches. I call them coffee clutches, but you know, girlfriends of mine would get together and I serve the coffee and all they would want to do is come to my house to drink coffee. So I said, I need to start selling this stuff, you know? 
so that was the birth of the idea of row beans, right? And um, so I started, I didn't have that much confidence in myself in the beginning. So I, my, my business started in 2011. It took me that long to build up the confidence like, yes, they like it. Is somebody else going to like it? They just liking it because they're my girlfriends. You know, so then I started trying it out on other people and, and, and they started liking it. Then I said, well, maybe I can sell it, you know, and um, eventually I, I started, um, I, I got my labels and everything and bagged it up and I started selling it. Um, I've always had this idea of having a mobile coffee unit, you know, that I can go to different places and set up. And uh, last year, I, well, 2018, I brought a truck. And um, and I worked on that truck until I Robin, got it the way that I you know wanted it. And um, Robin, could I'm I gonna yes. Could I interrupt you? Uh, didn't you also tell me you make uh, homemade desserts, like spectacular desserts? <laughs> yes, we do make desserts. I want to see the desserts. Well, right now, see, that's what I was trying to figure out. How? What can I? Because I wasn't at the event. What we do. Also, this is a seasonal thing. Right now, we're making hot chocolate pops. These are hot chocolate pops. You, you get a hot a cup of milk, swirl it in the milk. They come with a little spoon, swirl it in the milk, and you got you some hot chocolate. Marshmallows, chocolate chips. I never understood so, what a hot chocolate bomb was. So you just have hot okay. milk, and you stir it in, and it makes hot chocolate? It makes hot chocolate. Grab me a hot chocolate bomb. So how do I get some now? <laughs> how do I get you? See, that's the thing. You can DM me or you can use my, you can DM me. I'm on Instagram and I'm on Facebook. You can also uh, um, use my email, robeansbeans at gmail.com. We, we've got that on the chat. We've got that on right. the chat for you. But um, let me ask These you, hot chocolate Robin, bombs. We wanted to get a hold of these before the holiday. Would you be able to help us out? Would we be able to meet you somewhere and, and yes. get them? And yes, so I can mail them to you. And how yes. much are those chocolate bombs? The chocolate bombs are five dollars a piece. How much is a case? A case? <laughs> I got a lot of friends. Okay. Twenty six. This is my manager right here, my son Richard. Hey Richard, thanks for joining us. What else do you have that we can buy? Uh, you we also have, have, I have my coffee. This is a half pound. Uh, I can do a pound too. We, um, we gift wrap it for you. These are 12. The half pound, I mean, the, this is a half pound. It's gift wrap with the gift card and our little card here. I'm sorry. It will be our information on it that's attached to it and also we have a pound one pound um coffee bags that's um twenty dollars and what and then, what and other desserts do you have you have uh two minutes well our our main thing isn't desserts our main thing is coffee we dessert our main thing is a service we're a coffee service okay so we do parties we do events my son right now is, is using our espresso machine. It's making a little noise. I also do. Do you do cafe au lait? It sounds like a barista over there. Cafe au lait. Exactly. Exactly. That's what we are. And We're a barista. We also do. We have a do-it-yourself cold brew kit that we do. And and those are fifteen dollars for the do-it-yourself cold brew kits. Cold so, brew is a lot. Uh, you don't use heat, you just use cold water. It's almost like if you remember sun tea. Yes. If I remember sun tea, you yes. make cold brew the same way, but you let it sit for like at least eight hours, eight to 12 hours, you get the best coffee you ever had in your life. Oh my goodness, who knew? Yeah. That's then we have our bags, so our half pound bags of coffee. We have uh, full one pound bags of coffee. My is son he, is here. But is we're, he we're, pouring me a cup? Yes, he's pouring you a cup right now. <laughs> this is what, what a unique idea. I'm so impressed, Robin. What a unique. I really wish you guys could have seen us in action out, out while we're out, you know, in our setup and everything, because that's our main thing is our setup. We have a very unique, eclectic look to us. Um, 
that we have, you know, that draws people over to us. So we do parties, we do music events, we do uh, conf whatever, whatever um, event well, we're having. I'll, I'll tell you what, Robin. When there, before you before you leave, there was a question in chat if whether or not you have the hot chocolate without the marshmallows before you we can leave. do anything you want. We can take <laughs> the marshmallows out. We have espresso. We have espresso ones. We have three flavors. One is espresso, one's peppermint, and the other is we call it chocolicious. Do you ever That's put all. liqueur in those chocolate bombs? No, we don't. Days. Well, Robin, I'm very impressed with you and your business idea, and I wish you the best of luck. And when this COVID thing lifts, I know many of us are going to have just one big party, right, Carol? You can probably come to um, our our place and the 55 plus communities, and well, you know they have truck exactly. vendors. So we'll, we'll get together. I'm going to introduce the next speaker. I cannot thank you enough, and I'm so glad you were able to join us. So thank you, Robin. Thank you. Thank you. I hope I gave enough information. Anybody have any other questions, just uh, DM me in the chat or I'll reach out to me on, on Gmail. Perfect, Robin. Robins at Gmail. Thank, thank you. Thank you again. Thank you. Merry and Christmas and Happy Hanukkah. Thank you. And now we're switching over to uh, my friend, Jeremy. Uh, Jeremy, welcome. Can you? Can, uh, I can. I can hear you. Oh, Hi, good. everyone. Great. Jeremy, I just wanted to introduce you and, and, and people might say, well, why, why is Jeremy uh, joining us? And it's because I'm going to tell you a couple of things. One, um, he has helped me with my marketing and helped me understand SEO, like how to get, how to be found. And that's the name of his uh, co company. You can be found. Yep. And I think this is important for everybody to know. So Jeremy, um, what can you tell us, like, what is the most important thing we need to know about what you and your company can do for us? Sure, and thank you um, for every, everyone for having me here today. Um, it's tough to follow wonderful uh, coffee and hot chocolate, but uh, I'll try to do my best with some internet stuff. Um, so as everyone's thinking about wonderful hot chocolates, um, you can hear a little bit about how the internet works. And, and with SEO, which is, is getting Googled um, when people are out there searching for you, it actually parallels a lot of what you guys are doing. So the body is a very complicated uh, entity to have to deal with and try to optimize and, and keep healthy. So while you are all experts in, in providing tools and, and methods to make the body work its best and, and stay healthy, what I do is I help your website work its best and stay healthy so that you can get found by people that are searching for what you do. So Google is very complicated. There's all sorts of different factors and things involved with with what makes your website pop up when someone searches for it rather than somebody else and i sort of much like a lot of you live and breathe what you do i live and breathe the google algorithm so i spend a lot of time keeping on top of the tweaks they make to it to make sure my clients can can tweak their own their own website so that they show up google actually calls seo rankings organic rankings because it's supposed to mimic what happens naturally with your website but in all actuality as we all know you need a you need a little push to do things the right way and in the right direction and, and i help people with that it, it is confusing jeremy for people like myself that this this is not our forte and this is a brave new world for all of us in technology and it keeps changing so um I go to professionals for uh, my taxes and accounting. Right. I go to I go to professionals, um, you know, when when it's outside of my area of expertise. So I go to you because the algorithms, or how would you say, the the rules of the game of how to be found are right. so complex. And you're if you're a small business owner. Um, or if you want to get noticed as a as a celebrity trender, uh, <laughs> you need you need to contact someone like you to guide us through guide us through. So what easy um, 
things can we do on our own before before we start contacting you to say, hey, I need help? Like I used you for Google Ads. Um, right. I, I had no idea what I was doing and you helped me with that and you also did the analytics. So what, what could we do to help ourselves? Yeah, I think the very basic stuff is, I've been doing this for about 15 years and I say the ABCs have been the same since I started and the DEFs change every three minutes. So <laughs> once, you, once you get to the DEFs, then you might need someone like me. But when you get to the very basics, it's really about Think about your user. Google will tell you the number one ranking factor is user experience. So on your website, you wanna create content that answers users' questions. Google's job is to provide the best answer for someone's question. So if you have services that you offer, you should think about that and create pages on your website that answer what people might ask you about your service and explain why they should choose you, um, why they should choose the service you're offering, and just create unique content for everything you can think of. And th think of the user first, because that's so most important. When you say content, that's where I get a little foggy minded. Is that like a blog? Is that writing articles? What does that mean? And where would I put that content? Sure, and, and it's, it's sort of all of that. Content kind of universally means all of that. But from a website perspective, it's a page. So a blog post is a page on your website. There's, uh, some people will have a service page on their website. Those are all pages. They're just different names for the same kind of thing. So if it's an individual page on your website, that's a piece of content. So you may have a service page that talks about that very specific thing you offer, but you also might write a blog post that is even more specific about a, a factor of that or, or why that's changed this year. Um, for example, I mean, of course, we all know this year has been a crazy different year for everyone. So it was a, an opportunity for a lot of people to show up for things like, like, for example, I did a post on Zoom SEO training. So I would have never had to even think about that a couple of years ago, but that became a big thing. So all those little things that pop up in your market that you might want to speak to and that you might differentiate yourself in, you should write content about that because that, that gives you a chance to rank and, and show up when people search for it. So, so step back for a minute. You said Zoom SEO training. You mean yeah. like if I offer a class on Zoom, how to, how to advertise for that? Yeah, if, if you have a training for what you do that's on Zoom, it's good to have a page or a blog post, as you said, either way that says, I do this. This is this is how my user should contact me. This is how much it costs. Um, sometimes cost is a touchy subject because it varies, but explain why it might be a complicated and it's not straightforward for cost. All of that stuff that a user might wonder about, the, the barriers that are keeping them from hiring you, just knock those barriers down and make it easy with, with the content on your pages. And Jeremy, you are so generous in your uh, wisdom and knowledge because you are always you. posting articles on LinkedIn, on Facebook. I follow Jeremy and I really learn so much from these articles. So thank you for, for that. Could thank you, you um, tell us what what is uh, really important about um, for SEO? What is the most important and what sets you different like I've already said what I think sets you apart from others right. but from your perspective uh, what sets you apart I, I think it's the individual attention so every five ten years ago um, there were sort of the same basic rules and everyone could kind of have a canned plan and rank but since everybody does it now every single search on Google has a different competitive landscape and it actually has different factors depending on what people are searching for. So someone that actually pays attention and creates individualized custom plans for you and your market. And a lot of that just doesn't happen anymore, especially for small businesses, because a lot of the companies that do do that, they do it for corporate level stuff that spend thousands and thousands of dollars a month. Well, if you don't mind me saying, I went to a large company for years who convinced me that they were doing SEO for me. And it was so difficult to speak to someone directly. They made it like a half hour of questions before you could even talk to someone every time I called up customer service and they kept telling me that they were doing you know SEO and I found out I was throwing money away um, so 
what I like about you, working with you is one, you answer your own phone, you do get back to people, you do know what you're doing, and I I know that you're working for me. Whereas with these other companies, I couldn't track what they were doing. They would they kept saying, "Oh, we're putting you out there," but there was no um, uh, tracking method, and I, I just think that right Thank now. <laughs> I, I hear that story quite a, quite a bit, and unfortunately, I think some of the companies hope you sign up and then kind of forget about them, and they can just charge you every month, and uh, and and then just go away. So I, I hear that all the time, and it's unfortunate because it gives the industry a bad name. I hang my head in shame. Um, I'm the poster child for that, and and I I just I anyhow I went to you, and I, you taught me so much, and you also worked with um, my website person um, so that, you know, we don't have to have separate people. Now, yeah. uh, Jeremy, on the line with us also is Dr. CJ Rhodes, who um, is an IT um, professional as well. She teaches at Clipstown University and oh, great. Um, she teaches IT and, and really, I think the two of you at some point might want to connect um, yeah definitely maybe but, over um, one of those coffees that we just heard about <laughs> exactly well, and i gotta say you know i am i'm a pretty adamant adamant advocate um for people not paying a lot of money to these companies that say they're going to do seo and don't really i can tell from what you just explained to everyone that you are the real deal. So I'm very, I'm very pleased to have heard your, your Thank thing. You um, and that you understand what it, it's all about content and that your job is to, is to help the people figure out what content is going to be of interest. And it, it's not any kind of fancy um, tech, technological magic because it's not technological magic. And see, good old fashioned. No, you got to answer the questions that people are going to answer. Yeah. And Jeremy, I can tell you this very frankly, CJ is, is speaks black and white. If she thinks you're a phony or not doing stuff, she's, she's going to go silent. So for her to give you, without even meeting you, a, 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 a nod and saying, yeah, he's the real deal is a big thing because well, thank you very much. She, she weeds them out right away. And, um, <laughs> I, I, uh, uh utilize uh, CJ, yourself, and also my website person. It, it really is a team effort. And it really is. I remember years ago at one of our networking events, um, there was a, a PR specialist, marketing specialist, and she was getting bombarded with questions and said that she finally admitted she couldn't even keep up with the technology. And Facebook keeps changing. We all know that. So Jeremy, yeah. thank you for joining us. Please. Oh, my pleasure. Please stay on because CJ is now going to introduce. CJ is multifaceted. Like, <laughs> I I think I do a lot. CJ does circles around me. So if you stay tuned, CJ is going to uh, come on the screen, and she's going to tell us some uh, different things that she does as well. So CJ. Thank you. Thank you, Jeremy. Happy holidays. Thank you. You, you as well. CJ, um, first of all, thank you for helping us today with the first time we've ever done an online event. And you do wear many hats. And besides um, being an expert on, on different technology and helping me with, with simple coding, um, it's another language. Can you tell us about your HPL and what, what that is? Okay, well, HPL stands for Health, Prosperity, and Leadership. Um, and I, I actually have two organizations that are named that. I have a Health, Prosperity, and Leadership Institute, and I have Health, Prosperity, and Leadership Consortium. The consortium is a for-profit technology firm that used to be called ETM Associates or Enterprise Technology Management Associates. I changed the name in 2012. I was um, hurt. I, had, I got injured in a very bad car accident in 2002, November 5th, 2002. 
Um, I almost lost my business. I almost lost everything. I also almost lost my house. I almost lost everything. Um, but I finally was able to turn it around and get out of pain because I had, had chronic pain um, and overcome some of the brain damage that I had had that was causing me problems. And when I as I was recovering, it occurred to me that I didn't want to do what I used to do, which was to consult with um, very successful business people, helping them to make more millions more dollars in their companies. That's I was a management consultant, a strategic management and strategic technology consultant, and that's what I did for a living. I made a lot of money at it before my car accident. After my car accident, I decided I didn't want to go back to doing that. And so I really, I decided I wanted to dedicate my life to helping people to overcome the same kinds of um, things that I had to overcome. I had to overcome the fact that I had used up all my savings and now was not only broke, but borrowing money to buy groceries. I had to overcome that I had mild traumatic brain injury that caused some things like prosopagnosia, I don't recognize faces, and difficulties with times and places and dates, which makes it really difficult for me to manage things. Um, I also uh, needed to overcome Overcome chronic back pain, back and neck pain, which came from some of the injuries that from the accident. So, because I had to overcome all these things, uh, and I had to do it without using opioids, because I was on opioids for a year, only to discover that no, no, this is not a good long-term solution. So, I had to get off the opioids, and I had to start figuring out how to get out of pain without opioids. I decided I wanted to, um, and I figured out how. By the way, I have, I'm, I'm, I ha still have chronic pain, but. I, it doesn't bother me. I don't. It doesn't doesn't interfere with my life at all. I'm very very productive. Um, I would say, be not not in spite of the pain, but because of the pain. Because one of my one of the ways that I stay out of pain is to stay busy all the time. Um, when you're busy all the time, you don't notice the pain. So that's one of the one of the things that one of the reasons I'm so productive. And if if you look at my resume, you will you will be very shocked at how much is on there, how many books I've written, how many present presentations I've done, how many conferences I've attended, how many organizations I've run. I just it's 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 uh, even I look at it and I go, who is this person who did all this? But it's because I stay busy all of the time, mm -hmm. um, and I do a lot of physical therapy and me meditation and massage therapy, tai chi, Pilates. Um, uh, um, yoga. I'm, I do all of the integrative health practices. So I decided in 2012 to change the name of both of my organizations. I had a nonprofit organization and a for-profit organization, and I decided to change the name for both of them to Health Prosperity and Leadership. So Health Prosperity Leadership Institute is the nonprofit organization, and um, Health Prosperity Leadership uh, Consortium is the for-profit organization that's still doing the technology part of it. So I do, I'm still doing a lot of technology. All the technology work that I do for the nonprofit, I do through the, the consulting firm. And, and this is what we've decided to do. We've decided to try and provide to small groups and, um, and individuals such as yourself, people who are running um, holistic health organizations or um, uh, uh, organizations that help other people with prosperity, like uh, budget consultants and, and tax advisors and people like that, um, as well as people who are in, uh, educating others in leadership. So there's a lot of, there's a whole workforce development, leadership, personal development, life coaching stuff that's all in there as well. We are developing technology tools that will help them reach more people. And we call it SIRWEF. That's not gonna be the name when it gets marketed. That's just the internal name while we're developing it. It stands for contact management, invitation management, re um, a resource management, web management uh, and event management and payment management. So these seven items 
are available for free with lots of different kinds of programs all over the web. I mean, there's tons of, you can go to Seabright and Seaven and, Umbra, you know, there's hundreds of them. None of them work together and they're all difficult to use. So that you have to be a technology person to be able to use them. Cause I've been using all of them for years and years myself with all of the organizations that I helped. But what we're doing now is we're developing a single platform that will include all of those features to help other people be able to utilize technology without being really, really technical gurus. So okay. that's I'm, it, I'm going to interrupt you now because we have one more minute with you. But in a nutshell, you have a nonprofit which which does a lot of educational and also we you've done a lot of like tai chi and qigong events and supportive of education supportive of children that's one branch and then you also have the more uh for profit that's more technologically um very quickly can you just uh tell us again about our january 16th summit and just in a nutshell, what that's about, because we got to jump to the next speaker. Yep, one of our organizations is called World Tai Chi Day. It's our largest organization. They've been running World Tai Chi Day for 20 years. It's the last Saturday of every April. But of course, in 2020, we weren't able to do it um, in person. Uh, so we did it online and we decided uh, to do it again more than once a year now because it's easier to do online. So on January 16th, we're going to have a World Tai Chi day online summit um, it's with uh, dr. Um, Peter uh, Wayne and dr. rich Richard and I can never pronounce his last name so, yeah we shouldn't, shouldn't anyway there we're gonna be online at two o'clock um, Eastern time you can go to world tai chi day org to register for it and it's going to be a two-hour discussion about chi and the science of holistic health and the science of chi between two highly noted experts in the field so i hope you all enjoy i hope you all will join us there you can go to um uh, like i said world tai chi day org in order um, to register. you know what cj if you could put that in the chat and i'm going to jump to our next speaker I will do that. Okay, thank you, CJ, and thank you for being a part of this. And so now we're going to Gloria Brown. Gloria, it's so nice to have you on today. Oh, you're you're muted, Gloria. Can you unmute yourself? Thank you for the invitation. Uh, the speakers have been fabulous, and I'm learning quite a bit. Wonderful, Gloria. Um, I love your products. I met you about a year ago, and can you tell us a little bit about or show us some of the products you you have and tell us um, a little bit about yourself? Well, I'm an herbalist and an aromatherapist, and um, I've taken classes with uh, some of the notables like Susan Weed and Robin Rose Bennett, uh, David Winston, and others. Uh, I am a product of the Trinity School of uh, Natural Medicine, the Chestnut School of Herbal Medicine, uh, as well as the Pacific Institute of Aromatherapy. Oh, and my currently. Goodness. And currently, I'm working on my final project, I'll be so happy, uh, for my diploma in organic skin care formulation. Uh, it's a two-year international course, uh, which will help me expand my line of products into cleansers, uh, facial toners, um, micellar waters, etc., cetera, et cetera. So I'm looking forward to uh, getting my certificate. Oh my God, Gloria, I... I had no idea. I mean, I just loved your soaps and your creams, but I never knew your background and you're name dropping people like David Winston and others and 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 some of the, the, the college that you went to for studying um, some of this and the herbalism, the depth of knowledge you have is so impressive and I, I, I mean, I was just thinking, you know, you were just cooking up these handmade soaps, but you have the knowledge, you really are a, a consultant, you really 
you know, work with all of these to get, so do you have any products to show us today? I do, but I, I did want to say a little bit about All in Women Herbals and the name. Uh, my background is West Indian. Um, my dad was from Jamaica and my mom's uh, family was from Trinidad and Bermuda. And so I was kind of paying homage to them by using the word island, but giving it kind of a British twist, island, you know? Oh, I, I didn't realize that. And as well as, you know, um, I also suggest that after you use some of my products that you will be saying, ah, that's very nice. <laughs> so it's kind of a twist on the word island. That is so cool. I always wondered how you came up with that name. That mm -hmm. is so cool. Do you... Uh, Go ahead. I was just going to say, do you have some actual, like, products to show us today? I do. Um, I uh, have a, a few. Uh, I'm very happy with my, my salves. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. I mean, cameras are wonky. Yes. So I have uh, maybe five or six different salves abs, which are uh, herb-infused olive oil. Um, and then uh, you use a beeswax to um, harden it just a bit. So it's like an ointment um, and that, you know, you can just place it right on your skin and it will, you know, disappear within minutes. And so it provides a layer on your skin that is, is quite nice um, and that it will assist you depending on which one you use. Like I have a, a calendula, which is very good for dry skin or sunburn. I have a wound healing uh, one with, made out of comfrey. Uh, then there's uh, muscle pain, and I use St. John's Ward as a base for that. Um, chamomile for irritated skin, and then there's the plantain and jewelweed for um, insect bites. Uh, it comes in two different sizes. The small is about eight, and the large one is 16, depending on what the oil is. Um, I also have two different beard oils for men because we cannot leave them out. I am in the process of developing other uh, products for men as well. Um, Could I stop you for a minute? Sure. Um, I had bought some of the balms uh, for friends, you know, the, the balms that you were just showing us, like the, the calendula. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah. I had bought them as gifts for some friends that had aches and pains or dry skin. How, what is the shelf life for those? It's about two years. I was, I was going to say, I bet you, not that I have the science research behind it, but I bet they would last even longer because that they're all natural ingredients, but a lot of them have a long shelf life. So that that's just wonderful and we all have friends that have like arthritis or chapped skin so that's wonderful now with the men's line that looks different what why is that like a tincture what's in the men's well line? it's it's an oil it's oil based um and uh i've used um jojoba oil in one and I use sweet almond in the other, which are very close to the um, structure of the skin. Um, so those, that's why I use those two oils. And then I, you know, fragrance them with sandalwood or frankincense or bergamot, etc. Kind of fragrances that men would like. It's not the fruity, uh, flowery, like rose and geranium and, and some of the others. So are these, are these oils for like their dry skin or like for shaving? These are beard oils uh, to help them be, uh, soften the beard as well as to help it be more manageable. Uh, oh, okay, uh, could you say that one more time? Because I didn't quite hear what that was. Oh, it, the oils in them help to keep the beard softened and oh, more manageable. Oh, the beard. The beard, okay. The beard, right. Oh. 
Gee, I, I never knew all this about you. So could I ask you, we have two more minutes with you. What is the most important thing you want us to know about your products or, or yourself? Like if people, I put in chat how to get in touch with you, but would you have products in stock for anybody who might want them now? Absolutely. Um, I do small batches so that they're always fresh. Um, I make sure that they are a safer version of all natural skin care because I remove the chemicals and I remove other irritants like uh, parabens, the aluminum, the petroleum, and things like that. Um, I would just caution people that please be careful what you put on your body because it will end up inside of your body. And you wanna make sure that um, you need to read ingredient labels. And part of my uh, charge here is also, I conduct workshops to help educate people about alternative remedies and to teach them how to craft their own products. I encourage people to even create their own uh, medicine chests or apothecaries with some of these items. So in other words, Gloria, we, we could work with you directly and you would customize like um, a skincare for us, correct? Absolutely. Special orders are our... Um, specialty? Specialty. All right. Gloria, yeah. thank yeah. you. So thank if you. there is something, if you're allergic to something... Thank you so much for joining us today, Gloria. I, I, I learned things about you I did not know. I hope when we have in-person events, you will join us again because you are a wealth of knowledge. And I'm so appreciative of your time today. Thank you. Thank you so much. And I'll put a coupon code in the chat. Oh, she's going to put a coupon code, everybody. Great. And we're gonna switch gears now to my friend, Michelle Granberg um, in Plainsboro. And Michelle, thank you for joining us. You, you're beautiful as always. You're always like glowing and there's a radiance about you. Yes, yes, you're just a radiance about you. So Michelle, I know about you, and I think a lot of the people on, on, on our line today know about you, but for some people who have, this is the first time meeting you, please tell us a little bit about yourself. Hey, Siobhan. Yeah, I've been doing what I do for a really long time, and I offer a lot of things, so I'm going to try really quickly to tell you a little bit about everything. So I'm going to speak kind of quickly. <laughs> well, so have well me Michelle, take a deep breath. You have plenty of time. You have, you have 10 minutes. And Michelle, okay. you are a, uh, what I call uh, a frontier person because before I got involved in all these practices, before most people did, you already had a health center. So God bless you for, for leading us into the next century, so to speak. So thank you. <laughs> I, it's fascinating. It's amazing to me to look back and think about how long I've been doing this and, and how long I've known so many people and that we're still part of each other's lives and the, that this community is growing. And here we are right now in our little boxes, all connected in this community. So um, happy holidays, folks. As Siobhan said, I'm Michelle Granberg. I've been offering life transforming sessions for almost 25 years. Gift certificates may be purchased for yourself, friend, friends and family. And if you simply mention Siobhan's event, you'll get $15 off when you contact me. My office is actually located in Princeton. However, all the following are offered either in person or remotely. So I offer private uh, Reiki sessions and private trainings. You know, Reiki is a system of energy healing that works to clear balance and boost your energy system. Most people find it deeply relaxing as well as energizing. My sessions are intuitively driven and I integrate other complementary healing tools such as sound healing, um, crystal healing, shamanic practices and guided imagery. You also receive intuitive messages gleaned from reading your field, reading your energy. Uh, I'm offering also one-on-one -on -one pri private Reiki trainings, all levels. So the time has never been better to learn Reiki for yourself. I also offer transpersonal hypnotherapy. Hypnotherapy utilizes hypno hypnosis 
therapeutically. It's a combination of techniques that guide the mind into an open and receptive state. The uses for hypnosis are virtually limitless. I can help you decrease old thought patterns to make room for new ones. Hypnotherapy can promote personal growth in any area. Examples, improving self-esteem, stopping smoking, reducing anxiety, releasing fears and phobias, improving public speaking skills, and so much more. One of my biggest specialties is past life regression therapy. I was professionally trained by Dr. Brian Weiss. All of your past lives are encoded in your subconscious mind. Every memory is accessible. Past life regression therapy is a process of assisting you to directly remember your own past lives. Past life regression helps you understand the karmic reasons behind the people, places, and experiences in your current life. Past life regression helps you understand yourself from a broader spiritual level. I also offer mindset resiliency coaching. Mindset coaching is a series of intensive sessions that target the thoughts and beliefs that are operating your mind at the most fundamental level. Many types of therapies only address the conscious level of processing. Mindset coaching sessions explore core beliefs, keystone stories, and underlying emotions that are running you at the deeper subconscious level. Then the work is to, act, is to activate new patterns and instill new mental habits. I also offer, from my wealth of experience that I share with you, holistic business coaching for budding entrepreneurs. So whether you're a, you're a startup needing direction and first steps or an existing business needing to reboost your passion or tweak your business model, I can support you with business tools and strategies. Holistic business coaching sessions are designed especially for healers, psychics, and coaches of any kind. Now, I also offer private and group meditation and mindfulness instruction. Meditation is neither mystical or, nor mysterious. The meditative state is that open, receptive, and heightened state where we experience a sense of stillness and timelessness. When made simple, meditation can be practiced by anyone with desire, patience, and commitment. There are many techniques. All of them lead you to focus on attention in a non-judgmental way and draw the mind away from constant ruminating thoughts. Let me teach you one-on-one -on -one how to meditate, and our all sessions include handouts, videos, and recordings. I also offer mindful eating sessions. Most of us eat mindlessly. Mindful eating is bringing sacred, non-judgmental, Siobhan's like, uh-huh, is bringing non, is sacred, non-judgmental awareness to eating. So you improve your eating choices and develop better habits. I'm also a shamanic practitioner. I can teach you how to shamanic journey as well as journey on your behalf. The shamanic journey is a practice common to all indigenous societies throughout history. Shamanic journeying brings you higher wisdom and offers you an interactive spiritual experience. During a shamanic journey facilitated by the beat of a drum, I enter an altered state of consciousness to journey outside of time and space into non-ordinary reality on your behalf. So it's based on your questions and intentions, and I return with spiritual wisdom and guidance that is both specifically practical for you and enlightening. Just a few more, get through them quickly. I also offer Akashic readings, <laughs> which are past life readings, basically. Um, and the Akashic records are like a vast library where every human life is recorded for all eternity on a non-physical spiritual plane. When I give you a, pr a private intuitive reading, I set aside ordinary awareness, raise my vibration into a trance-like state similar to channeling, then based on your specific concerns and questions, I open your soul's record to bring forth um, knowledge directly from the source of all knowledge um, to answer your questions. I might also connect with spirit guides, angels, and power animals. So that's really fun. I also offer free go vegan coaching sessions. So being a vegan means making choices that are 100% in alignment with cruelty-free action toward animals. This includes not eating them, wearing them, or purchasing any products that contain animal byproducts or were tested on animals. These sessions are designed to support you in making the transition to a completely vegan lifestyle and will meet you wherever you are in the process Sessions are free and there's no obligation. This is the only free service that I offer 
because I'm committed to creating a vegan world. I'm also a trained and certified pet loss bereavement specialist. Pet loss is extremely painful and hard. Nobody should go through it alone. As your companion on the journey, I create time and space for you to talk about your feelings, about your pet's loss, and to truly be heard. In addition, I give you resources, educational information, and coping tools that are tailored just for you and your unique situation. I'm also a certified laughter leader. I can offer those programs, but I'm gonna skip that for now, telling you more about that. Finally, I'm a host of Positive Energy TV, which airs on Princeton Community Television and is archived on my YouTube and Vimeo channels with well over 100 free shows, Positive Energy Spotlights guests and topics such as spirituality, holistic healing, music, chanting, intuition, veganism, and animal rights. I hope folks will check out um, those channels. You can just go onto YouTube and search or go to my website. So everything I offer makes really unique gifts. If you're looking for unique gift ideas, gift certificates, again, may be purchased for yourself, even friends and family. If you mention Siobhan's event, you'll get $15 off. My office is in Princeton. All sessions can be done in person or remotely. My website is michellegranberg.com. Thank you, Michelle. And oh my goodness, I'm, right? I'm like, it, it really shows that you've been in this work for such a long time because you have such a wealth of knowledge. You have so many different practices. It's like, oh my God, what else does she do? But what a wonderful representation of a holistic lifestyle that you have all these different specialties and you have to be healthy and centered and aware to be able to acquire all of this wealth of knowledge. So you walk the walk. You have also supported so many of us coming up in our practices by having a health center, um, by having us uh, teach at your place in the past. And I want to give a, a, like a personal shout out that I did do a past life regression with you, which was very interesting. Um, I think I would like to do that again, or the uh, Akshonic, um, I can never pronounce that word, the Akshonic readings, but um, I thank you so much, Michelle, for helping to give us um, a, a platform, but also to inspire us to go above and beyond, because you are something else, lady. I'm, I got to tell you, God bless you. <laughs> you do it all. So I highly recommend um, Michelle, and I want to thank you for joining us today, Michelle, and may I wish you and your family a happy holiday, and I'm going to jump over to Vanity, okay? Okay, love you too. Okay, Vanity, thank Hi, you. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Hi, Vanity. How? Oh, my goodness. How did you do that behind you? I want that. <laughs> It's a, like a little backdrop. It's like a tapestry that I got when I started to decorate my practice space. So thank this you. Is, this is a tapestry. Oh my goodness. It's gorgeous. And thank Vanity, you. like Michelle, you just radiate the mm -hmm. energy. And, and if CJ is listening, the chi, CJ, she's radiating the chi. And it really <laughs> shows um, and glowing. And so... You are a, a big proponent of holistic health and it, it works for you and you also um, help others. So Vanity, just tell us a little bit about yourself and I'd like to know how you got into this work because I have a feeling you've always been walking the walk. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. And first, um, I want to just get out of the way. Michelle is such an inspiration to me, listening to her and just everything that she's involved with. Huge inspiration. So thank you so much for sharing that. Um, so uh, I, since a young age, I feel like I have always lived within my heart center, uh, my heart space. And uh, the older, wiser I got, the more I became just so more familiar with like all the possibilities when you embody you know 
unconditional love for the self and all those around you. And I always consider myself like a natural born healer and uh, a being here just to provide love and a creator of love. And I found out what uh, Reiki was. So I, I went to go get trained and attuned um, in Yusui Reiki levels one, two, and three. And then while I was decorating my space, I came across a book called Angelic Reiki, um, The Healing of Our Time, Archangel Metatron. And as soon as I read that, I knew that that was my sole purpose. So wow. I, I definitely work very closely with the angelic kingdom of light. Um, so that's what I'm here to share with all of you tuning in today, um, bring the awareness of my holistic practice to you, um, resourcing our divinity uh, to birth a new world paradigm is like the most revolutionary act that we can do here um, and we can commit to and um, my, my practice allows the nakedness of our soul uh, to be in communion with our source aspect, our, our, our oval soul, over soul, um, our higher self. And uh, when that happens, we become an empty vessel for the spirit of source to pour through. So my practice absolutely, uh, without a doubt, offers that to my clients. Vanity, can I interrupt you? Um, first of all, um, I'm, I'm going to mention an observation that I made when you joined us in person um, live at one of our annual events. Um, and then I want you to explain what it is you actually do, because in case people don't know what, what Reiki is, I would, I would like you to explain that. But what I noticed about Vanity was she was new to our holistic health fair but she was busy all day long and she has a very quiet um, but open presence about herself and without naming names there was another a person at the event that was more well known um and i bent over backwards to do some special things for them and throughout the whole event they they had such a negative experience and because of that they weren't getting any traffic and here you were just very quiet and just doing doing the work your energy attracted people to your uh table to your practice and that that to me is a, per, a true practitioner you walk the walk you don't have to be bombastic to, to draw in the clients. And you truly, like I said, I just knew that you were going to say, since you were a child, you were walking this walk. So please explain to us, what, it, what exactly do you do? What is angelic, how is angelic Reiki healing different than, than Reiki? And what, what is that for those who don't know? Absolutely. Thank you so much for your kindness. <laughs> Um, so angelic Reiki, it, um, during a session, both the practitioner and the recipient merge consciousness with a member of the, the most perfect energy, which manifests for that particular client to heal them on a soul level. Um, you merge consciousness with these divine sources of unconditional love and um, they offer a soul level healing. So they, they clear anything as um, um what a, i can't talk are not, you are you not, saying that because i never like heard across of, all like they heal across all time that is so beautiful time and space uh, they're multi-dimensional beings so they 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 see you as the divine perfect being that you are the embodiment of love your birthright is to have a very sovereign um you know, so you're a conduit, man, vanity. You're a conduit yes. of 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 super energy. Would it, would that be a great way to say yeah. it? I try to. Well, I ask spirit to assist me in being the most pure conduit channel possible to share love, light, language, and um, provide the sacred space for those to get in tune and in touch with their angelic guides. So, at your event. I, every time I get into my healing work, I just ask the angels to bring forth whoever they know through their higher self and, and, you know, the connection that we make 
to to come and welcome the gift like it's a gift that keeps on giving and a, and a connection that keeps growing uh, because you literally merge consciousness with these multi-dimensional light beings so it just expands consciousness um, it definitely promotes relaxation um, and overall healing overall um, well-being and unconditional love you are surrounded and filled unconditional love wonderful vanity we have two minutes um i know you're in the middle of transition you're 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 building a yurt was that correct that you were telling me besides having a a physical center you're also having a, a yurt as well can you tell us in two minutes <laughs> yes um so spirit during this um you know this pandemic uh i got so many downloads that i am to incorporate nature in my practice so i am located in florence new jersey right now and i'm offering healing treatments both in person and distance um remote uh, treatments till the end of this month only before i pack up this beautiful room which i'll walk you through i didn't realize we were neighbors vanity you're one town so away from me <laughs> Oh my. Oh, hey doggy. What's your dog's name? That is a gorgeous room, Vanity. Who who's the handsome uh, dog? This is Um so yes, I'm offering treatments and right now because I know during the, the busy holiday season and the stresses and some traumas that people have endured during this year, um, I think it's been a phenomenal, monumental, expansive year. Um, but I know some people are experiencing some things. So I'm offering all of my sessions 20% uh, off at this time. And um, and where are you moving to, Vanity? Okay, and we're talking about the year. So Spirit wants me to incorporate nature in my practice. Um, I gave a couple of people Reiki on the beach during the summer and out in parks, and it's just been such a glorious experience for both myself and my clients. So I'm going to be building a yurt in Hamilton, New Jersey. I'm moving in with my beloved twin flame uh, January 1st. I'm so appreciative of that and all the other opportunities coming. Um, but my practice will physically be in Hamilton, New Jersey when I actually build the year up. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to be involved with my friend who has a practice in New Hope, New, uh, New Hope, PA. So that's where I'll be eventually next year. But right now I'm offering still treatments in my location in Florence. So you'll I be in two locations as well as non-locally. Vanity, again, thank you so much. It's a joy. I hope when we have our in-person events, you'll join us again. Absolutely. You're an inspiration. Thank uh, you. Just, just really wonderful. Thank you. Happy holidays and best Happy wishes holidays. On, your, on your move. And now we go to Marie, and I'm very excited because Marie is a friend of mine, and uh, I have been encouraging her for years <laughs> to transition into what she's doing now. I kept saying, Marie, you got to start, you got to start. And now you're doing it. And look, you even have a shirt that has <laughs> your <laughs> business. Oh, my goodness. So, Marie, tell us what you're doing now. Well, first of all, thank you for Jean, Siobhan and Dr. CJ for having this event. And yes, it's been a long journey and it's, I think it was well needed. You know, my, my path has been that of nursing, massage therapy, Reiki, hypnosis, EFT, all born of, I think, um, as we all have our own personal issues and looking for that, which makes us feel better. And, um, you know, and unfortunately we turn to different things as well, you know, self self-harm behaviors, addiction. Um, sometimes we don't know why we react the way that we react to situations or we're in relationships that are not healthy. And what I love to do is to help people uncover uh, what it is that's affected them so negatively in living their best life. And so in using EFT and hypnosis, um, I help them to uncover that. EFT helps to balance out the energy system which is thought to come from negative emotion and neg negative experiences. And hypnosis helps to speak to the subconscious mind to bring about change. 
because very often we want to make change, but for some reason it doesn't happen. You know, the, the diets don't work, the stop smoking doesn't work, the, you know, and it's because the subconscious is trying to avoid change. It feels safe in, in staying where it is, even if it's negative. It's comfortable, it's known. Marie, so with these, yes. Could I interrupt you? Because for some people who don't know what EFT, emotional freedom technique, could you demonstrate, um, and, and, sure. and I'm, I'm going to let everybody know, just like I have worked with Michelle, all of the practitioners should get energy work um, from one another. We, all, we do the work on ourselves, but we need other people to also do work on us. Um, Marie has helped me with EFT because I never know what to say when I'm doing it. But um, Marie guides us. But can you just walk us through a very simple tapping so people could actually see what it is? What what is EFT? What it looks like, and yeah. you know, and I will warn you, it looks funny. But I think because we all have worked with energy and different things, we're more open to to this. But especially now with the stress that we're under with the current pandemic, and that's what kind of has prompted me to do this full time. I have left my nursing career. Um, because for me personally, I think it's limiting. You know, there's only so much that I can offer people within that realm, within the, the guidelines of that, where this uh, speaks to many aspects of what I think um, is useful for people and helpful. And it's also uh, something I'm very passionate about because I see results quickly. And for example, it could be something as simple as, um, you know, uh, just having stress or anxiety about the, the current situation, the, you know, the current pandemic and the fear of the unknown. So what you could do is you can start on the, just tapping lightly on the karate chop point. This is what we call the karate chop point. And you're going to state whatever it is, what issue that you're encountering, whether it's a headache, whether it's um, you're angry with somebody, or maybe it could even be vague. It could be, even though I'm feeling unsettled right now, you could say, I'm not sure why. We just want to try and focus on whatever the issue is, whether it's emotional or physical. So we can start with, e even though I'm stressed about the, the current pandemic situation, I deeply and completely love and accept myself anyway. And you would say that three times, even though I'm afraid of what this, this situation looks like, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I'm not, I'm worried about the outcome. I deeply and completely, and you can say, honor all my feelings about this. I hope everybody's doing this now. Because oh, yeah, tap along, I'm, tap along, because you'll get what's called borrowing I'm, benefits. I'm actually getting more grounded as we're doing this. And Marie, I, as everybody keep tapping as we do this, there is a lot of science behind this. And a lot when of when you're tapping on these, these are called meridian points. And when you're tapping on them, they're affecting the amygdala, which is the flight, fight, or freeze response. And they're doing studies in Australia because they probably have, you know, more of an interest in funding to do that. If we don't make money here, we don't want to do it. So they're doing it there. But they're finding that it it's really helping with stress and anxiety. It's used um, with trauma and PTSD with uh, veterans. And studies are showing that it's extremely effective without the whole re-immersion technique and traumatizing them all over again. So Marie, if the military is picking this up because it's safe, it's effective, and it's cheap. I mean, you can you can do this, and some some of them have done major strides just in one session. Absolutely. And I don't know so much that it's the mil military as it is people like myself working. With, with the, the veterans military. and getting the word out and the founder right. of EFT emotional freedom technique is Gary Craig and Carrie Craig decades ago went on his own dime to the veterans yes. uh, association and he helped several veterans they did a study he and his team and it was amazing just how quickly it reduced their the effects of PTSD the um the hypervigilance and the the ang anxiety and the anger and without medication without um reintroducing the trauma it's a very gentle technique too and it's going it to be very fast and marie although we can learn it ourselves 
I mm -hmm. felt I had to go to you as a guide to help me because even though I knew where to tap on my body, mm -hmm. um, you need another person to help you with the wording because we use words and affirmations with this. And I, I've seen demonstrations with, with people um, who overcame a fear of, say, a, a dog because the, the person was in their 80s and when they were 12 years old, they were attacked by a dog and they couldn't even uh, pet um, an overweight a uh, dying beagle that could mm. barely lift itself up. They were terrified of the dog. And in, in one session, uh, they were able to overcome that. I've also seen over a couple of days, a woman who was afraid of heights because yep. her teacher actually pushed her over the cliffs of Dover and then pulled mm. her back by, the, um, by her hoodie. He pushed her over and then pulled her back by the hoodie. Right. And as an adult, she couldn't be on a plane or, or in a hotel suite overlooking a balcony. It's very effective. So, um, Well, you know, this is the thing. Um, even things that have happened decades ago in childhood, we think that, well, that was a long time ago, or I've gotten over that, or that doesn't matter anymore. The subconscious mind is holding on to it. It has no, no concept of time. So it's still affecting us now. And when we just build and we keep these traumas just layers and layers, right. this is a great way to uncover it and neutralize it and free yourself from it. So we were saying about the, the tapping points, the, the side of the hand is where you'll start your affirmation right. what, and you're focused on whatever the issue is. And then you're going to go to the eyebrow point. Mm -hmm. And we can say this fear of the future. I'm just using you know, the current yeah. situation. And you can continue to tap with me because you will feel the benefits right. of it. Marie, thank you. We've run out of time. Oh, and I just quick. wanted to let you know, I think you know Ka Ka Kathy Welshman. Uh, she's a fellow um, practitioner and uh, nurse. And she has, uh, has said that she's taught it to her nine-year-old grandson who was very anxious with virtual schooling, as are the parents and grandparents that have to be with the children online. I, I hear this a lot. Um, and then Jean also uh, wrote that she's used it many times with her clients and patients and herself. Yes. So Marie, yes. thank you. We put your contact information in there. Um, your wealth of knowledge. We appreciate you being with us, and uh, we'll talk to your counterpart in a couple of minutes. <laughs> and if okay. you want to jump in with him, that's fine too. Okay, so thank you. Okay. Happy holidays. I'm thank now you, going to our wonderful uh, Dr. Mary Hernandez, and I'm so um, thank you, uh, Mar Dr. Mary. I've, I've, you were with us um, at our actual uh, in-person event last year and I uh, just love homeopathy and maybe you could explain to everybody what that is. Yes and thank you so much for putting this together Siobhan. This is wonderful and I you know I really appreciated all the other presentations here but I have to correct you in other countries uh, homeopaths are called doctor but here we're not really even recognized. Oh. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, but I, I do practice homeopathy. I'm a holistic health practitioner, and homeopathy is at the core of my practice. I'm also a nutritionist, a health coach. I've trained in other modes of holistic care. Um, but to me, homeopathy has been so phenomenal in terms of its ability to promote self healing mm -hmm. that that's really you know, what I, I focus on. Um, and many people, when they hear the word homeopathy, uh, think anything natural, herbs, <laughs> essential oils, uh, and all those things are wonderful, but homeopathy is an entire system of care that um, runs on its own set of principles. And it's been around and helping people to heal from serious chronic illness and and acute concerns for over 200 years uh, so i have an office in new york city and staten island but i also see people from all over the country and many parts of the world through uh now zoom i used to use skype 
but um, I'm still available on Skype if people prefer to use that. I specialize in working with children with autism, ADHD, learning disabilities, um, as well as adults with autoimmune issues and chronic concerns for which conventional medicine often doesn't have many answers. Um, and I work with a lot of families who are overall healthy and don't necessarily have any serious concerns, but want to stay healthy and are concerned about potential side effects from conventional medicine treatments for standard childhood illnesses and things like that. So um, that said, what the hell is homeopathy? Yes, um, I was going to say, Mary, <laughs> tell us, because a lot of people don't really know what it is. So um, we have a saying in homeopathy, we don't treat the diagnosis or the illness, we treat the, the person. So homeopathy is truly holistic in that sense. And um, what, what we're doing is understanding that like cures like, and this is a core principle of homeopathy. So rather than trying to suppress symptoms, by conventional medicine. So say you have an infection, you're going to get an antibiotic. If you are depressed, you're going to get an antidepressant. Homeopathy says we have an innate capacity to heal ourselves. So if there's something that is a chronic issue, it's because something is blocking that capacity or um, overwhelming that capacity. And so with homeopathy, we're finding a remedy that enables that heal, innate healing energy to open up, to bring ourselves back into balance so that we can heal ourselves. Um, and in that sense, it, it, it's truly amazing. And under the principle of like cures like, the idea is that within nature, any substance in overdose that could cause certain symptoms can prepared homeopathically heal those symptoms. So that sounds like a mouthful. Um, what does that mean? If you had burning, tearing eyes and your nose was running, I could give you Allium Sipa, which is homeopathic onion. And that would rapidly ease those symptoms because a fresh cut onion could cause those same symptoms in a person. And that's, you know, that's a pretty simple example on a, you know, level of someone with an autoimmune disease, things get a little more complicated and then you need someone who really has training in homeopathy. But on a, on a simple level like that with colds, allergies, sore throats, earaches, um, you can learn to apply the principles of homeopathy yourself. And I, in fact, I do workshops in that for parents so they can treat their kids with a basic, basic 36 remedy kit for basic childhood illness. Mary, could I, could I ask you, because this sounds a lot to me like um, some of the vaccines that we have, and I'm not talking about, you know, just COVID, but it's like, you you're, give a little bit of the, um, how would you say, the problem to the body, just a little taste of it, so the body can naturally heal. Is that a correct uh, analogy? Well, I think originally the concept of vaccines was based on a similar principle, um, but has moved away from that in the sense that vaccines are actually substance. And homeopathy is really a form of energy medicine. So when a remedy is prepared homeopathically, say we're going to take an onion, now, I don't do this myself. I, I leave it up to the homeopathic pharmacy for the most part. But you would take an onion tincture, one drop, mix that with 99 drops of water, succuss it, which is not just shaking, but vigorously pounding to energize the water, a um, hundred times, take one drop of that solution, mix it with 99 drops more water, succuss it a hundred more times, and at the point where I do that 12 times over, there's something called Agravado's number, that there's no longer any substance wow. of that original onion left. Right. Not a molecule of onion. And yet, paradoxically, the energetic healing power 
for that water uh -huh. to heal what an onion might cause is increased phenomenally. And most of the remedies that we see like over the counter in uh, vit what's it called? Um, vitamin shop and whatnot are 30 C's. So that's already diluted one to the 3,000. Wow. Um, and Mary, we have a question. Um, and I also, you, we have two more minutes. I, I want you to stress about working with uh, children with on the autistic spectrum. But someone just asked, do you work with type 1 diabetes? Yes, I do. Um, and type 1 diabetes, particularly if it's gone on for many years, um, the the underlying factor cannot be totally overcome, but there can many I've seen many people have been able to really reduce their insulin. Wow. Um, and reduce other symptoms. And what about ADD with children? So I specialize in working with uh, kids with ADD, ADHD, um, Right now, I'm seeing with this pandemic that a lot of kids who maybe had mild symptoms now because they're spending so many hours in front of a screen that those symptoms have just really become accentuated. So yeah, I'm working with a lot of ADD and ADHD right now. And I'm sure a lot of adults now too, you know, talking about the stress of you know, helping the children online with the classes, the technology, and, you know, not knowing, um, except for like hours before school is about to start, that they have to keep the kids at home. The stress levels are, must be uh, phenomenal. So, um, Mary, is there any other uh, thing that you'd like us to know before we say a parting adieu from you? Um. Well, I was just gonna say uh, a lot of people are concerned now with um, those emotional issues, anxiety, stress, et cetera, um, sometimes depression, particularly with folks who are home alone and mm -hmm. you know can't connect in person with friends. And homeopathy really can help with that. Um, additionally, uh, people are very concerned about optimizing their immune system. Um, for obvious reasons, I can't go into a lot of details in terms of preventive, but I, right. I have a number of um, remedies that have really helped people with staying healthy. And, um, and also if they've had a virus dealing with overcoming some of these long-term effects, you know, uh, some of the most common are people who are dealing with a level of chronic fatigue or lose their capacity to control their body temperature. Um, Mary, I'm going to interrupt you. Um, someone commented that your explanation was so helpful because they never knew how to explain it. And I would say, look up Samuel Hahnemann and, and how his little uh, cart uh, actually created homeopathy and, and, and Hahnemann Hospital was named after him. And Helen is asking, is this affordable? And I'm going to answer, yes, yes, yes. Right, Mary? It's very yes. affordable. It's very affordable. And I do a 15-minute free discovery session where you can contact me at my number and um, I will learn about your concerns and talk to you about what my approach would be so you can decide if we're a good match. And they could they could do this online with you, right? If they did not want to leave the house, they could do this online with you? Absolutely. I Right now, most people I'm seeing by Zoom. Wonderful. And like I said, I'm seeing people from thank all you. over the country and all over the world. Mary, so, yeah. thank you so much for joining us. It's a pleasure. I hope you'll join our in-person event when we can do that. So thank you and happy holidays. Thank you. Thank you so much, Siobhan. Bye-bye. Hi, Walt. How are you? Uh-oh, you're muted, Walt. You're muted. Now I'm now. unmuted. You hear me? The technology muted himself. But so, I'm okay now, right? So Walt, I have to say, is your is your better half with you? <laughs> My better half is downstairs in the uh, Tapping the healing.
Okay, and, and is Studios, Marie, and I'm upstairs here in the engineering office. And I offered to Marie that she could join you. I hope you don't mind. She might pop up. No, absolutely. I, I, can, I can see her here. And I wanted to plug her, uh, her business, which is Tap into Healing. And, uh, and I am with, with Hypnosis for Everyone, which is a branch of Tap into Healing. We're the fun branch. She's the serious branch. So, yeah, but, I can't wait to hear about this, Walt. You two have been uh, uh, designing this practice for some time, and I, I can't wait to hear what's what's happening and, and how we can get a, be a part of this. Okay. The first thing I would like to say, even before we get in, into what I'm doing, is um, the tappanyhealing.com went live last night so i would appreciate everybody here to go to tappanyhealing.com and help me debug the site <laughs> and marie is shaking her head but um it's uh, it went live last night there there might be some bugs in there that we're trying to iron out the other site is hypnosisforeveryone.com and that is not really ready for prime time uh, but you can go to that site also, and uh, that has, uh, that could needs I a ask, little work yet. Well, hmm? could I ask Marie to type it into chat, the tap into healing, because, uh, I, thank you. Okay, so, uh, Walt, can you tell me, how did you go from being an engineering to be, to be interested in holistic techniques, and why hypnosis? That's an easy question. Uh, almost five years ago, I met Marie. And now being an engineer, and I build radio and TV studios. It's, uh, I've been doing that for decades. Um, I met Marie at a widow and widowers group. And she started talking to me about holistic this and holistic that and EFT. And, and I'm looking at her and say, what the hell is all that? You know, I'm, I'm a skeptic when it comes to all those things. But after, after she dragged me to various conferences and uh, <laughs> she's like, that's true. Uh, you have to go to this. I'm going to this conference. It's about EFT. Let's go and learn Tai Chi, Tai Chi Cha. And um, let's do this and let's do that. And after the first year, I said, you know, there really is something to this holistic uh, healing. Uh, I'm seeing people, I'm hearing people, I'm reading about things. I read a lot. And um, I, I got to, uh, to accept it, you know, and understand how all this works and how the chi system works and how the, the various pressure points and, and all this. So I, Marie has been in hypnosis for a long time. And I said, you know, when I was about 12 years old, I read a book about hypnosis and how to hypnotize yourself. And I tried for days and days and days, I tried to hypnotize myself, stare at the spot on the wall and you'll fall asleep in a deep sleep. And I said, this doesn't work. So I don't know, a year ago or so, I, uh, I said to Marie, you know, I think I wanna learn this. There was a course being offered and uh, I'm gonna sign up for it. And Marie said, well, you know what? I could use a refresher. Let's take the course together. And we did. And uh, I learned that hypnosis is not what I thought it was when I was 12 years old. You don't go into a deep sleep. You don't become Woody Allen and steal the, uh, the jade uh, jewelry. You don't uh, walk around in, uh, you know. And quack like a duck. Quack, oh, you can, you can, I, uh, I can do that. Uh -oh. um, Not on me, Walt. <laughs> but anyway, I learned that hy hypnosis is nothing more than a very relaxed state. And once you close your eyes, if everybody closes their eyes right now, take three deep breaths, you will be in the alpha brainwave state. And that is the state where you will accept suggestions um we can go deeper and deeper and deeper so i um i said you know what i like this and i think i'm going to go with 
um, certain aspects. I wanted to go with um, contacting spirits, past life regression, future life, between lives. And, um, and I like working with groups. I used to teach, you know, I, I like working groups and I want to do group non-smoking. Okay, Walt, I got to stop you. Because okay. I never, I mean, I have to ask for myself. I never knew you could use hypnosis to contact spirits. Yes. What? <laughs> yes, you can. Now, I would not be the one to contact the spirits. You would be the one. And what we would do is put you into a, an alpha state maybe even slightly deeper. I would have you create a spirit room, would have you use your imagination, would have you think about somebody that you would like to invite into your spirit room. Um, could be anyone, could be someone from, uh, from your past, it could be uh, a loved one from your past, it could even be somebody like uh, Thomas Edison or, or George Washington, anybody you want to bring into your spirit room. You can invite them in there, have a chat, get some questions answered, ask them questions, and then let them go. So you could have closure. You could actually give us a doorway to having closure. I, I never realized that that was a part of hypnosis that, that you could be, I mean, how exciting is that? And you also do past life regression work. Same thing, bring you in through hypnosis, have you walk, uh, walk along a hallway and there'll be a whole bunch of doors and you can open a door and see which life you're at and so forth. It's all part of metaphysics, which is, you and, know, that particular well, science. I wish we had more time because for you being a skeptic, I <laughs> would love to know about your personal journey um, with this uh, hypnosis work. And, and I'm, I'm sure you have a great story about your personal journey with it. Yes, yes. You know, I, you know I studied to be a funeral director. You know I worked with the dead and embalming and everything. We used to I, I forgot about that part of your life. And unfortunately, we don't have enough time. I know, I know. I'm going to invite you for this, if you don't mind. Go ahead. Just in case somebody doesn't pop in, that another speaker misses their opportunity, if you and Marie want to hang around, I, I want to ask you that question. How does that sound, if you have that, time? That, that sounds great. But for but right I now... I can't guarantee it. Okay. I'd like you to look into my eyes. No, Walt. No, Walt. I love you and have a great holiday. It's great to see you, okay? Bye. And bye. Now we go to my good friends, a mother and daughter team, Linda and Sarah. Oh, my God. I'm so excited to see you, Linda. How are you? Very excited to see you as well. Very well, thank you. And you? It's not that I'm not excited to see Sarah, but it's just that I, <laughs> Sarah, or, or I haven't seen you in a couple of years, but Linda, I know you, uh, well, from a couple of different walks in life, but I know you from Linda's Body Butter, uh, when we're talking about holistic, but now you, you had this shop. I didn't even know about it. Tell me about your shop, what you're doing, get us up to speed. I'd be glad to. Um, I started the business in 2010 and I've uh, been doing craft fairs, holistic fairs, street fairs, and um, I got to the point where I was basically building a client base and then like at the end of the year, you know, the, like the holiday season ended, I would lose that base. So I started to look for um, a location and uh, luckily I found a really great unusual place at the uh, New Egypt uh, flea market village. There's 40 uh, shops and um, it's open on Wednesdays and Thursdays from 8 Wednesdays to 2. And Sundays. Wednesday and Sunday, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you know uh, my client base is meeting me there and you know we've added a lot of products um, you know, to the line as well, body butter, soaps, um, uh, Sarah makes candles. If you want to uh, give a word out about your I, I all natural candles. That. Yes. I didn't know that. And Linda, 
I, I would give your body butters as gifts to my BFFs. And, you know, one of them was like, where did Linda go? You know, uh, yeah. so yes. now you found a home, but please tell us about all your different products if you would. And I love your tree in the background. By oh, thank you. <laughs> well, I started out uh, because my older uh, granddaughter, Lissy, was highly allergic to um, you know, different uh, products, you know, that were on the market. So I started to research and that's how I started the body butters. Um, and then, you know, I would make lotions for her and then I got into making soaps for her. They are as natural and um, organic as, as I can make them. And, uh, you know, we added lip balms and I'm going to add, um, you know, shower bar, uh, shampoo bars and you know, just a lot of great things that are very healthy for your skin. I look at it um, as if I'm not able to pronounce the ingredients on the labels, I do not want to personally use that uh, product because your skin absorbs within like 25 seconds of applying, um, you know, a body butter or lotion, you know, or, you know, one of the um, chemical induced products that are on the market for sale. That that is a wonderful. So you have the body butters, we've we've used that, the lip balms, um, soaps, were you doing soaps also? Yes, I have a, a line right now of charcoal and goat milk and just a regular bath bar. And um, you know, once the holidays are over, I'm going to uh, go back uh, and start re researching more soaps, uh, get back to the oatmeal soap, um, you know, and any other that the, um, I was going to say patients from the dental <laughs> office, you know, 30 years in a dental office, everyone's a patient. <laughs> but uh, custom, uh, customers now. The dental office. <laughs> <laughs> Linda, Linda, what what is the benefit of charcoal soap? I've never, never, I mean, I know about it for toothpaste, but. Yes, um, like I said, I've gotten requests for the charcoal soap. I haven't researched it enough to be able to manufacture it myself. I do have all the ingredients, but right now time is of the essence just to get, right. get through the holiday season, but that's, that's on my list to uh, make for the new year. I was like I just said, curious of the benefit of charcoal soap. That I like I said I have I oh, really okay. I I don't know what that is, but there are three or four uh, customers that came in asking for it. Uh -huh. So I bought the ingredients, and uh, you know after the holidays uh, in okay. January when things slow down, I will research it, and if it's something that I feel. Um, that I could put on my shelves right. and, you know, a benefit to uh, my customers, I definitely will do okay. that. And then Sarah, um, oh, it, uh, Kathleen, Kathleen Welshman, who's a fellow practitioner and nurse, says she thinks it detoxes. She thinks the charcoal helps to detox, um, probably. So we'll look into that. Now, Sarah, um, how beautiful you look, dear. <laughs> <laughs> You said you do candles? I didn't know. Why are you guys <laughs> keeping such secrets from me? You know, I'm like one of your biggest shoppers. Uh, <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so I make 100% soy candles. I can custom make any scent you want, or you're more than welcome to stop in the shop and see what we have. And just like her lotions and soaps and body butters, all scents are customizable. So if you smell something in a soap or lotion, that you would want in a candle, we can most likely do that. Um, do you have so I any have these. To show us? Do you have any candles to show us or products? I to show well, us? I the one I brought to show. This is my other thing that I do outside of our our storefront at the New Egypt Flea Market Village. I do things more directed towards kids. However, yeah. adults do like to do it. What is it? This is not sand art. This is actually a candle. No. And um, I have most children make it, but this is the exact jar that we use for our candles. So just picture white. So are you wax saying it. you're saying I could go to your shop and make a candle? <laughs> yes, which leads me to my next point, which is uh, if you are interested um, in ho in having you know like a girls' night 
or some type of party. You can have a group of, you know, coworkers, friends, family come uh, contact me or my mother and I can host a candle making party and it can be either soy wax or the, the granulated wax, but this takes about like five minutes, not People, even. Well, can you fit in your shop if it wasn't COVID? Uh, what would you say? We have a studio at the flea market yes. village, so it wouldn't be in our shop. It would be in a studio that is for making projects. Oh, so and they have a stu Is it a is it a, a studio open to anyone, or is it particularly? I would, I would think so. I would have to ask Allison. Uh, she's my neighbor, like across the passageway, and uh, she does arts and crafts uh, at her studio on uh, Tuesdays. And, um, you know, the, the studio is open, uh, you know, for, uh, I'm thinking for anyone to uh, rent it, is but it's, it's not very open for a Tai Chi class. Is it like too open? small? Probably. Yeah. I mean, you'd probably be able to fit like you and three people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There, I mean, there's tables and there's arts and crafts. Um, and we got to get Robin from Row Beans and do a girls night at, at your place. Right? How many Absolutely. how many people can do the candle making? I would say um, maybe six. Six. I, yeah, six, I would com yeah. comfortably six. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Just okay. because wax and you know. <laughs> and, and is that during COVID or after COVID? Well, we have to uh, follow the uh, regulations right. of the governor, and I'm not sure what um, he has uh, announced today. Right, so right. It, it's kind of like a day by day basis. The flea okay. market, I believe, if the state of New Jersey does shut down, we will be able to be open because we're outside, you know, and oh. it, it's not contained. So you don't necessarily have to go into the shops. We could bring tables out and you oh, could shop okay. outside. That's good to know. Very quickly, we've we've got a couple of things. Gloria, who was on earlier and also um, has a lot of training in herbs and things, said um, charcoal is good for oily skin and, and acne. And CJ yes. said it's great with uh, people mm -hmm. who have sensitivities to soaps and fragrances. So um, wh what parting, because I have to uh, jump now to uh, Candace, what uh, parting words would you like us to, to know? Well, um, I would like to welcome everyone to the shop uh, to give my body butters and lotions and um, handmade soaps, lip balms, shower melts, bath bombs uh, a try. Uh, they're great holiday gifts and you're really doing yourself and your skin a favor by using um, as natural as a product as I could produce. Okay, Kathleen is asking, is there a website that she can order this from? Facebook page and on the Facebook page you could message me uh -huh. um, and, I, and I could put the email address in the okay chat. Kath Kathleen I'm just gonna say this they're right around the corner from where I taught in New Egypt they're not that far from you um, so I'm sure you guys could arrange a, a pickup um, and I want to thank you both and um, okay so are is is the market open um, before Christmas extra hours or anything? Yes, actually, um, we're there tomorrow, Sunday from 8 to 2, and then I'm hoping Wednesday, but with the um, Nor'easter, I'm a little concerned, but Friday, December 18th is going to be a huge event. Um, there's going to be an ice sculpture, um, sculptor doing ice sculptures, uh, you know, a caroling, bonfire, Santa, it's just going to be absolutely wonderful. And that's the 18th. How cool six, is six that? Six to nine. Well, much success to you both. Stop keeping secrets. <laughs> <laughs> I think you guys are doing a fabulous job. I'm going to say goodbye and happy holidays. And we're going to meet with Candace Snyder. So Candace, okay. thank you for joining Thanks, us. Thanks, Javon. Bye-bye. Happy you holidays. Thank you, Candace. Thank you for having me. I'm excited because I want to know about anti-aging hair care 
and I'm 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 a woman of a certain age who's mm -hmm. starting to get worried about about certain things. That so please help me. What 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 is Monet and why do I need it? Okay, well Monet actually stands for modern nature. Um, as you mentioned, we are an anti-aging hair care company, but we also offer skin care and wellness products. But just like your skin changes as you get older, so does your hair. You know, oh. your hair gets thinner. Sometimes you get breakage. Um, sometimes your hair will actually change. So maybe, you know, when you were younger, you might have had like oily roots and now your hair is super dry. Um, maybe it's brittle. I'm your poster girl. Help me. I'll admit it. Um, so money offers... Uh, shampoos, conditioners, styling products. We also have hair growth products, but everything is natural and botanically based. We're vegan, we're gluten-free. We actually follow European standards by banning over 1,300 toxic ingredients. You know, the United Unlike the States, right? Europe is more uh, stringent about the natural products. That's great. That's true. The United States bans maybe 40 ingredients. So there's a big difference. Um, the other thing that makes us stand out is that we're not one size fits all. So if you were to go to say a drugstore or a supermarket or maybe even a big bigger store like a Ulta or Sephora, say right. you're looking for volume and you look on the shelf and you see there's a bunch of different volume products, but that might not address all the other issues. And as, a, as an example, I have a hypothyroid, so my hair is dry, my skin is dry, I color my hair every four to five weeks, so that's another, you know, makes right. my hair dry. Um, so you want to take into account all the issues, so we have you take a questionnaire, and then based on your questionnaire, we decide which products are the best products for you. And it's like that with our skincare and our wellness, too, so we have like actually three different questionnaires. To, and to get where, the right things in your hands. Where can we find you, Candace? If we like, I'm, like I'm sure I can do this online. But uh, do you have a shop, or do you have a con consultation place, or? Well, I, I mean, I do have a website. I'm an independent contractor with money, so it's my own business. But the website is, you know, all designed through money. So I can give you my website, and you can look on there. But I actually love to talk to people about their um, right. concerns, their issues, their wants and needs. Yes. Because sometimes the quiz online just spits out a whole bunch of products that you right. might not necessarily need. Yeah, so. I would want that one-on-one. -on -one. So if I wanted to meet with you one-on-one, -on -one, do you have a office or? The, the best thing to do is I can hop on a phone call with somebody or I could do a Zoom meeting with you and have a face-to-face. Um, and so I could just give you my phone number or you could message me through Facebook. I am on Facebook. I'm going to um, tell you right now, I'm setting up an appointment because I am the poster child. Like I said, women of a certain age. So for you young ladies out there, uh, if you don't think it can happen to you. <laughs> but it's never too soon to start taking, you know, care yeah, of yourself I, and using the right products. Yeah, I know a young person that will remain nameless that um i say early 30s and is having hair loss and you know that that is unbelievable so yeah there are so many different things that can cause that from stress and medications and yep. especially autoimmune disorders so many disorders can totally cause um problems with your hair or your scalp um, and you know, it only takes 26 seconds for those toxic ingredients to get into your bloodstream. That's, so that's another not, thing that you want to think about when, what products am I putting in and I on mean, my body? This has been repeated like three times now from yeah. different practitioners and I never knew it was that instantaneous. So I, I have to be careful, but Tell me, you you were talking about a, like a giveaway. If somebody places an order, you're you're going to do a raffle. How would that yes. work? So if somebody places an order, you know, I just I have your information, and um, I will be 
I will do this midweek, uh, this coming week, just to give people some time. But I will put you in a raffle for two products. And I'm the type of person that doesn't like to just give away whatever. So based on whoever wins, I will tailor products that they can use. I'm not going to give you something that you're not going to be able to use. How wonderful is that? Now, could I ask you, Candice, do you have any samples? Does Monet offer samples? We do have samples. And again, that would be you'd still need to take one of the questionnaires right. and then I could determine which samples to send you. Right. But that's absolutely an option. How wonderful is that? Because I've been in a situation where I just like it reminds me of my conversation with Jeremy that I got hoodwinked by a bigger company. Uh, same thing with um, with a hair product. And, it, and um, what happened was I went online and I was looking for for gray hair, silver hair care. And this one company said that they were the um, experts in it and they did not give samples and I had to buy a full product and I'm one of these people that I, I don't expect a miracle with one, you know, one usage, but mm -hmm. after many uh, uses of it, it wasn't working and I couldn't get my money back because I used so much of it. So, you know, well, and, and I didn't have a person like you to talk to. They they just did it all online. Well, that's one thing I can definitely say. I, I do pride myself on customer service, staying in touch with my customers, making sure things are working. Because, you know, over time, just like, you know, when the seasons change, yeah. and sometimes you have to change your skincare, it's the same thing with your hair care. Sometimes you have to change the products as well. Um, we have a 30-day money-back guarantee. That's and I'll tell you that our products are concentrated. They don't have as much water as what you typically get, you know, in the store. So that your products are going to last a long time. On average, it's about four to five months for like a bottle of shampoo or conditioner. You know, Wonderful. At the time. I have two quickie questions. How long sure. have you been with Monet? About two and a half years. Okay. And the other thing is, do you have any uh, like holiday, like stocking stuffers if I wanted to get for a friend? Well, it depends on, it depends on what you want. So, I mean, I definitely could recommend products that would be great. Like I love our, I have some products here on my desk with me, our Berry Refined Scrub. It's an exfoliator for your skin, for your face. And it also is a face mask but there's no plastic microbeads. It's actually crushed cranberry seed. Huh. And it feels amazing once you rinse it off. You feel like you just had a, a facial. Wow. Um, so something like that is a great stocking stuffer. Um, you know, you could always do, my favorite product, I have to tell you this, is our dry shampoo. I was always a dry shampoo girl, but I never read the ingredients. 90% of the products out there for dry shampoo, the first ingredient is butane. Butane is lighter fluid. That's why it's not a healthy product. Right. We have no butane and our, um, there's no talc. Talc is another bad ingredient. We have rice starch in ours. And so it's great to refresh your hair with, with our and dry shampoo. One last quickie question. Do you have any products for people with rosacea? Our pro our skincare products, oh my gosh, the before and afters I could show you with rosacea. Definitely, we have two different lines. We have a Be Gentle line and a Be Balanced line. So depending on what your skin type is, most people okay. with rosacea are more sensitive, so you'd be, be, be gentle. Candice, I'm, I'm leaving the whole event and I'm calling you now for a consult. It's been okay, wonderful. Siobhan. It's been wonderful talking to you, Candice. Thank you for Thank joining you. us. Have a happy holiday. And I got to jump to Miss Sharon Shaffrey. Thank you so much. Sharon, are you with us? Hello, Sharon. Well, this is Sharon's page. <laughs> Sharon, you're on uh, mute. Okay, so Sharon, um, I think forgot where her time was. Or are you on, Sharon? Okay, so um, 
I'm going to see if Poonam is on and I'll jump back to Sharon because I don't I don't see her picking up. <laughs> Poonam, do you mind going um Poonam, do you mind uh, uh going on now and I'll put she, and, and while you're talking I have to text Sharon. And, and so Poonam is a healer and a medium and a spiritual counselor, a guide, a teacher and an interfaith minister, which I did not know. So while you're talking, Poonam, I don't mean to be rude, but I got to uh, uh, text uh, Sharon and please tell us about yourself. Thank you so much for having me here today. Um, well, I started my journey um, after my divorce and um, there was just uh, amazing guidance towards helping myself first and then helping a lot of women. I was so motivated to hold light for um, especially women uh, and children. And uh, that's where my journey began. And before I knew, I started attuning into many different modalities and, uh, you know, started channeling information. Um, and I started my healing center. Um, and now um, it's just a blessing that so many people come here and they transform every day. So, um, Poonam, can I interrupt? How how long have you been doing this? Because I just assumed that you you like some of the other practitioners naturally came to this as a young person. I'm sure you had intuitive abilities as a young person. But when, when did you start doing your practice professionally? Well, it's about 2000, uh, 2011, uh, 12, you know, when the big shift was happening, I, you know, started coming into my true divine self. Um, and I really, I was not really aware that I had those gifts, but I guess when we, when we, you know, align to our sole purpose, everything's yes. come, everything comes together and you flow with it you you know i became like a river you know i went through my divorce i you know uh started my had my two girls and they gave me so much strength to move forward and you know have big connection with india i grew up there and i started my uh factory there to you know for uh yoga apparel to empower women so everything as if everything was coming together for me and before i knew i'm here uh, you know helping women going through cancer um you know people with the chronic conditions i i am also certified to do reflexology um i'm an ayurvedic practitioner so that's kind of really help with nutrition with uh you know knowing our body mind and spirit and uh once we understand who we are i think a lot of our issues get resolved so when people come to me we first work at the spiritual level so uh that is like in tuning with their past traumas um you know physical pain that they're going through the diseases they are going through so my work first is to work with them one-to-one -one, uh, through the medium sessions where we do like soul retrieval work um you know people that have um, traumas from you know uh, as young kids or relationship issues we first work towards that and once we you know when they start understanding where the issues are then they tune in into themselves and and try to find the right path you know um because a lot of everything that you need is within us so when we as healers and uh, guides we are like we are the mediums and when we are able to connect uh the person with the higher divine self i think you know 80 percent of the issues start resolving so that's my work is i am just a conduit and i channel information and allow you know, to become aware of who they are. 
Mm -hmm. Poonam, you froze for a minute. I just wanted to jump in. I also remember from past events, you, you are very much an advocate for women and supporting women. Um, but do you, are you still doing like your clothing line, which helps supported women who um, were in need and they were designing clothes or, or uh, manufacturing clothes for you? Are you still involved in that? Mindfully um, uh, involved, and also we are we are actually launching uh, uh, a line for a medical apparel. Like women are going for breast cancer, so we are actually doing uh, that line as well. But I want to show you the our studio here. We have all the clothing that are done by women. Um, the apparel, you know, the 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 pants, all different kinds of pants, clothing. Um, we have specific bras or your yoga bras that we have created. Oh, so, that's and gorgeous. I know, isn't it? Uh, look at the tie dyes and we have the whole line for the, for women who are spiritual. They come here to buy clothing for special events. Oh, I love um, that. Whatever the white uh, uh, blouse is, I just love that. <laughs> and uh, look at these, uh, these uh, the scarves that are hand woven by women we put all the um i i put all the colors together and they do all this work so you know it's just empowering to see the women not, not taking abuse they're learning to empower themselves who now and, where, uh, where where is this store located we are in malvern uh we are in malvern malvern uh, pennsylvania, pennsylvania. Yes, yes. How far is that from Newtown or Langhorn? Probably, uh, maybe like 45 minutes from there, but from uh, King of Prussia, it's about 20 minutes or 15 minutes. Is it before King of Prussia? Uh, no, it is after King of Prussia towards, uh, you know, Downingtown. Okay. Um, yeah. I hear, I hear a road trip for any of my, my, my gal friends who want to do a road trip. I want to go shopping. Look at that. <laughs> and this is all support. Yeah, so these are. This yeah. supports so, other women. This is wonderful. So not only you, you you have so many facets to your uh, practice, Poonam. You are an inspiration and um i want to talk to you more on a personal level but i i always was impressed with you but i never knew your your background and your story um and i'm just wow look at all that she does you you were a dynamo punam so is there any parting words before we switch to sharon that you'd like to share with us yeah, so um, I have different gift certificates for this holiday. I know a lot of people are going through. So no, nothing better than giving a, a gift of, you know, holistic that they can use for Reiki. They can come here and do one-to-one -one sessions with me, you know, uh, whether it's readings, whether it's, uh, you know, helping with their chronic conditions because I do Ayurveda which is ancient healthcare system as well. Yes. So we integrate a many different facets to, to come to understanding ourselves first. So that's my work is like, you know, whether they need like reflexology to detox their body, to you know, get rid of the anxiety. So I walk uh, as the spirit guides me. And that's how, you know, I mean, if you go on my website, so www.circleoflifesoulcenter you can see testimonials of a lot of people right. that come here every day so Poonam, yeah. thank you so much i'm sorry to cut you off we have to jump to sharon i'd like to definitely. wish you a happy holiday and you better do my next event okay definitely thank you so much okay bye-bye bye-bye thank you sharon how the heck are you and where did you disappear from? Was it, I guess it was me. I gave you the wrong time. Yeah, I, you know, I've been checking and checking. I've had alarms set for the last hour and I went back to my email and it was like, your <laughs> time is 3.50. I'm like, okay. Well, so I can lock let me in. introduce the fabulous Sharon Sheffrey of Natural Awakenings of Ocean and Mammoth County. And for all of you practitioners out there, 
Sharon is so easy to work with. Um, I started with her when she first uh, gained the publishing rights uh, uh, quite a few years back. And out of all the publishers, don't tell the other ones, but out of all the publishers, she's the easiest to work with. She has bent over backwards for me and I just love her to death. And I can't wait to hear about what you want to talk about today, Sharon. Thank you. <clears throat> and I love you equally as much. And I love Poonam. I'm like, oh my God, it's Poonam. So <laughs> I've, uh, I've had readings from Poonam. I've purchased items from Poonam. And they're always beautiful. And Are we doing a road trip? <laughs> Are we yeah. doing a road trip? <laughs> totally. All right. oh my God. Totally. Uh, and I'm just like, I can't wait till the next event where we can all be together again. Can't wait. <laughs> yeah. So good to see you. <laughs> so Sharon, what did you want to uh, show us today? Because you said you have a selection of crystal jewelry. I do. I do. Um, and I'm going to show you that. Uh, if you haven't picked up the December issue, it is out now so, and they're going fast. So please do pick one up. A lot of good information, and I have with me today our most popular item, which is the Lightworker necklace, and this is one of my my all-time favorites. It's a piece of selenite with chakra. Yes, with the chakras in sterling silver. Cap Did you make that? No, I'm not that talented. I hope. Well, I you know, one day I hope to have some free time to learn the story. Right, right. Thing, but no, I saw this piece and I was like, oh my God, if, if ever there was something that represented the light worker, I think that this is it. So right. we have these available on our website, which is najerseyshore.com. And we put them, I'm, I ran out of boxes, so I can't show it to you. I have more coming on Monday. So what a great stocking stuffer. And they can order right now and get it before Christmas? Oh, yeah. Definitely get it before Christmas. I will mail them out Monday. And, and a nice Hanukkah gift, too. Yes, we are celebrating Hanukkah. Because um, it's the season of light. And selenite and the chakras are all about light. Exactly. Um, I, I actually have a um, piece of selenite that has the flower of life scored into it. And to celebrate Hanukkah, I've been lighting a candle on that every night. And I, wait a minute, what did you just say? What did you do? You put it, you put the necklace? I, mm -mm, no, personally, I have a disc that's made of selenite. And it has the flower of life scored into it. So to celebrate Hanukkah, I've been lighting a candle on that at night. And that's been my festival of lights. And nice. I like your new glasses, it. by the way. Oh, thank Look you. at her new glasses. Thank you. Yeah, my dog ate my old glasses, so I, I needed to get a new pair. And these are a little funky. Did you, did you offer it to the dog as a reason to get new glasses? No, I did not. I was actually not happy when I woke up and my glasses were in pieces on the floor. But I, I can't imagine. I can't, I can't imagine. But I love my puppy so much that it just didn't matter. <laughs> and I like your hat, by the way. Uh, so I tried to dye my own hair. I am now a redhead. So I've been keeping it under a hat. Why? I like it. I like that new look. Thank you. I like that new look. And I'll, <laughs> I'll do my hat too. Oh, I love your hat. It's very festive. I, that's what like that's what I like about this hat. Thank I you. Like, I feel like a holiday elf. <laughs> that's wonderful. What else do you have to show us? So I also have, I really love this piece. It is a piece of clear quartz crystal. Oh, I like that. It has pink tourmaline and green tourmaline. Ooh, tourmaline. It's, it's an energy booster that puts out prosperity and love vibrations. So I was really attracted to this one. Like jewelry is not my business, but when I see something that I feel like resonates right. with the audience, I get it and I put it in our store. So that's love and money at the same time, right? Yes. Can't can't beat that combo. No, I think that's a great combination. <laughs> 
Um, so I also have a couple of meditation feed selections. I have the traditional Tibetan wood, 108 beads. And then I also have these blue turquoise African beads. I like the, I like, I use them when I walk. Now, Sharon, somebody's already asking. Helen, I, I haven't met Helen before, but Helen, thank you for joining us. You've been with us since the beginning. She's asking you if you have a store. I do. The store is at my website, which is the magazine's website. So if you log on to najerseyshore.com. We have that in the chat also. Yeah, that'll take you to the store. And all mo yeah, most of these items are available on the store. This one I only have a couple of. So if you want the clear quartz crystal with the pink and green tourmaline message. Well, I'm getting hypnotized by the necklaces going like this, Walt. So outstanding. You will have a great 2021. You will have a great 2021. We all will have a great 2021. <laughs> exactly. Um, and if you're a horse lover like me, I also have this really pretty wrap bracelet that features a bit. Oh, and, look at that! Yeah, it's really, really look at cool. that! I love it a lot. Um, I have a lot of horse riders in my life, and so okay. it always makes a lovely gift for my friends. So I like having that in the store. And Sharon, we just have one or two more minutes. Oh, okay. Want me to go quickly? This is a beautiful blue with different crystals wrap bracelet. We only have one left. It's on the website. So if you like it, go get it. Um, this is a very popular item that sells out at every one of Siobhan's events. It is, um, oh, it's what is the stone it starts with an a it mm, it'll come back to me hold on okay but i have these two which are oh i like those yeah this is howlite so it's white howlite and blue howlite oh. and then it has the beads that represent yes. each of the chakras yes. what i like about this bracelet is it, you can wear it so it just shows the color of the bracelet but then the chakra beads sit yes. on your pulse point and for me like that's that's a powerful thing i like that a lot Karen, i didn't realize you had oh uh, she said power shell pow powie shell Anyhow, Sharon, I didn't realize you had, I think that's what she was calling your stones that you couldn't think of the name of. You know, oh, the, okay. anyhow, Sharon, I never knew you had all of these, all of these uh, jewelry. I never knew. What's that? These are the earrings that match the bracelet. No, I love jewelry, Siobhan. And so... I uh, never knew that about you. Yeah, I, 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 you I don't know. wear a lot of it, but I love it. And you've whatever. expanded what you what you do wow these are fun these are like a tribal teardrop earring these are available on the website those are really pretty and then this this is adorable it's um blue oh here we go candace said it's a a ma amazonite a ma amazonite. amazonite yes that's what it is okay so the bracelet and the earrings are Amazonite. Okay, and Walt, your question is um, uh, dependent on what, Walt's asking how much it is to advertise. You and Sharon can talk offline, but very affordable. Sharon, any, any parting words before we go to Doreen? Yes. This is a big popular item. It's a ring. That's Van Gogh, right? Sorry, yes. Friday night. Yes, and it's a, a great, a great stocking stuffer. When I do Siobhan's show, I sell it so many of these because it's so popular. So I just want to say thank you to everybody. Yes, and Walt, just so you know, Marie's eyes bugged when she saw the ring, so you might want to hop on it, Walt. <laughs> 
All right, you Dory. Good, everyone. Thank you, everybody, for your time. Sharon, thank you for being such a good friend, such a big supporter of all of our practices, and you were just wonderful. So I'm going to swing to Doreen, and thank you, thank you, Sharon. Happy thank holidays. You. Love Happy you. Happy holidays. Love you all. Okay. Bye. All right, Doreen, you have Hello. been so Can patient. You, you have been oh. with us the whole day. So patient. Uh, I can't thank you enough for joining us. Tell me all about It Works. Okay, so It Works is a wellness company. We promote better health and well-being. And so my most favorite product is Just Celery. This is awesome. <clears throat> so I used to juice celery, but I don't like to get up in the morning. So I'm always, you know, hustling, running late. And so the company came out with this just celery, not for me, but it's it an awesome product. <laughs> it's vegan, soy free. It's non-GMO, no artificial flavors. And it tastes just like celery it's all celery there's no additives and it's amazing and it's great for so many things like rosacea alopecia acne um it's good for your joints because i don't click as much as i used to like i used to click all the time you know yeah. from your joints i don't click like maybe i might hear it once in a blue moon but before i started using the just celery i would click all the time so, I didn't know. I didn't know it works. Made made supplements and and things like that. I did not. I thought of the skin wraps. I didn't know they did this. <laughs> so I have heard of the beneficial pro, uh, benefits of celery, but to tell you quite frankly, I don't want to eat celery all the time. So <laughs> how do I work with this? This could I add it into say? Um, the shape the the matcha tea that we saw earlier well the company suggests you drink it on an empty stomach by itself just water they don't suggest you add anything to it or add it to anything and it helps rosacea it helps rosacea it helps um alopecia it helps acne um hair loss ms arthritis inflammation so how, how much do I have to use? Like, is it like a eight ounce glass of water or six? Eight ounce, eight ounce glass of water. Yeah. You can, I mean, you can add more water if you like, but eight ounces so, is what it calls for. So I would use it before I drink my coffee or tea in the morning. Yes. Yes. Wow. Yep. It is amazing. I mean, for me, I'm not a doctor and I don't make any medical claims, but I can tell you all the clicking, which was driving me crazy, I don't hear it as much as I used to. Wow. Yes. So my second favorite is the sleepy tea. Um, if you know anyone who suffers in insomnia, or they can't go to sleep at night or they can't go to sleep at a reasonable hour, um this tea right here my son is a he's like a, a gamer so he's up all night but oh he, boy. he enjoys the tea he knows that it'll help him relax oh and boy. he's going to bed at a normal time instead of staying up till like five in the morning oh but boy it has um melatonin it has magnesium and chamomile and it just it helps you relax and it helps you calm down from wow. the day. And you can, you know, you can drift off into a nice sleep right. instead of tossing and turning all night, getting up all night, or whatever and the case are, may be. Are these products organic? So, are all the products organic? Um, or, or not all of them, but the celery juice is all organic. Okay, that's good to know. And how and, much is um, the container? Yeah. How much is yes. the container? How much is the container the con of celery? Um, as a loyal customer, that's one of our programs. Like for 90 days, it's $39 per month. 
retail is 65. So if you didn't want to do the 90 day program, retail is 65. So that and it's a big, large days. jar. That lasts you 30 days? How, how long does yes, that Yes, because you're only using, yeah, it's a month, it's a month supply. You're just using the scooper, which is always deep embedded inside, but it's a scoop per day. And that's to your eight ounces of, or more of water. Wow. Yes. So um, our keto coffee, we have a new flavor, which is peppermint mocha, which is, I'm sure, seasonal. Like after the holidays, I'm sure it'll go away till next time or what have you. And then we have the salted caramel. And then we have skinny brew, which comes in a sampler. So if you wanted to try it before you buy it, um, this is the sampler. The salted caramel and the peppermint mocha come in a K-cup which if you don't have the machine works did all this they oh my god we have like more than 40 products I we would be did. here all day if i went through every product well, and then what? there's just the regular keto coffee that comes what? with the creamer already in it doreen what's your top seller what's my what's, top yeah what's everybody buying the coffee the coffee mm -hmm. what's the top flavor the top flavor is the, um, it's between the salted caramel and the skinny brew because the skinny brew is just 10 calories. I didn't know coffee had calories. Oh, yeah. Oh, dear. Depending on what you put in it. Like some of them come, you know, with the flavors and the sweeteners, right. depending on what you put in it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And so we just have like, like two more minutes. What? Mm -hmm. what what do you want us to know about um it works it works saved my life i weighed 329 pounds no when way. i found this company and i lost 93 pounds it, no it works way. literally saved my life my god bless you when when did you start with the company i started with the company this is my second go round. i started with the company three years ago and then i stopped and then i started back again last october oh my god you should be the poster girl for this <laughs> are you serious doreen i didn't know that about you that's amazing yeah i yeah i was huge so product helped you the most um the the fat fighters, which I didn't get a chance to talk about, which help expel the fat from all the foods you eat. Are you still on them? Um, it depends on what I eat. I don't take them regularly like I used to. I drink the coffee regularly. I drink the celery juice regularly. And I use the, the greens. We have a, a super reds and a berry. I use these regularly. So go back and show me those, what worked for you? The celery, the fat burner, what's the in celery the is, the celery is new. So okay. this may be six what's months. What's in the fat burner? The fat fighters is a carb inhibitor. So say you eat maybe Popeye's chicken, you've been wanting it, you've been doing good, but you want that chicken and you eat the chicken 20 minutes after you eat, you would take two of these and it helps expel the fat. It has um, the raspberry ketones and the pepper seed. I never knew there was a product that takes the fat out of the food. Oh my yep. God. <laughs> well, not out of, it, it'll help you get rid of it. Oh, oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> oh, okay, I gotcha, yeah. I gotcha. Well, what if, what if you're uh so i just wanted to say i have any kind of raffle going on like if someone wanted to try something like i say try it before you buy it yeah they can they can reach out to me and they want to most of our products come in the to-go packets or the k-cups but i, I mean wanna try the celery doreen i want to try that so doreen before we go do you have any other uh, special things you want to tell us today 
just like people who are um, entrepreneurs like myself. Everyone likes to get a free gift, even yes. if they don't purchase something. Yes. I make up these little bags and I put two pieces of candy in it and my Aww. business card and I fill up a bowl and I put it on the floor in front of my table because people love to get something. Yes. So this makes people happy. Then they stand and they talk to you for a while and they get a little more from a customer. You were you were a doll, Doreen, and I want to thank you so much for your patience and patience with me because because you know I was kind of rattled trying to put all this together. <laughs> you did a fabulous job because I knew you were a little nervous about this, and aren't you glad you did so well? I that's why I started from the beginning and waited and watched everyone. You know, you did a great job, so Doreen. I could get pointers. Everybody support and, and everyone was excellent there's so job. many people i'm going to reach out to all right so, yeah there's so many people i'm going to reach out to so okay. remember and my Doreen, name i'm serious i want to try that celery before i buy it okay all we'll right it out. Mm -hmm. okay. absolutely happy holidays Bye, thank you Doreen. you too thank you all right now we go to uh not uh, our last person but uh, we're going to say a special person, Kaisha, who's Looks joining familiar. us. This is the first time I've met uh, Kaisha, and I'm delighted to have you. And I'm, I, I can feel your energy through our correspondence because you were very easy to work with. You uh, got back to me right away, and I want you to be a part of our team going forward. So. Thank you so much for joining us. So, Kaisha, tell us about yourself and what you do. I think you're muted, Kaisha. You're muted. There you go. You guys hear me? Hi, ladies. How's everybody? We're great. Good. Good. Tell us about so, Touchstone. Definitely. So, my name is Keisha. I know she's she's saying Kaisha. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Keisha. <laughs> I'm sorry. Listen, I'm good for messing up names too, so let me not mess up yours. How do you pronounce your name? It's like Yvonne, but it's Siobhan. Siobhan. Okay, I like that. All right. That's easy enough for me, for me to remember. I have a bunch of Yvonnes in my life. So, ladies, my name is Keisha Glasper. I am a small business owner with Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski. Most people have not heard of Touchstone, but we are the home division of Swarovski. So everybody's probably heard of Swarovski because we've been around for 125 years. Actually, it's our 125 year anniversary this year. Wow. But, um, yeah, I know, right? Touchstone, only 10 years. And me, only six years with Touchstone. So I'm excited to be here and share my wonderful sparkle. I like to say we have the best sparkle on the planet. All right, Swarovski, everybody knows us, everybody loves us. They actually call us um, the jewelry to the stars because we're all over the red carpet too. So um, I wanted to come on, and I thank Siobhan for allowing me to come on and share my business with everyone. But I wanted to come on and share our top five sellers. Why? Because one, everybody loves them. Two, everybody's shopping for gifts, and you still may need some last minute gifts. So I put together our top five favorites for you ladies, and hopefully you'll love them as much as everybody else. All right? So um, really quick, while I'm pulling the, the fifth, biggest seller that we have. I just wanted to, to let you know that Dan Swarovski created Swarovski uh, 125 years ago because he wanted diamonds for everyone. And most women couldn't afford them then. A lot of women could, can't afford them now. But he created a machine that cut the diamond at a fraction of the cost. So that's how Swarovski was born so many years ago. All right. Now the company's owned by the great great grandchildren and they decided to create a home division to bring Swarovski to your doors. Because most people had said they had never been to the store and they thought it was too expensive. So they came up with an affordable line. Price points $24 to $2.99. And only two pieces $2.99. So the top five. This is our fifth biggest seller, ladies. Hopefully you guys can see this okay. This, these are called the littles. Why are they called the littles? Because the style is to layer and stack your jewelry. All right, so you guys see, I have on one of my favorites. This is called High Class. Let me come up closer. 
High Class is one of our new pieces. It's only $59, but look how amazing it looks. It looks like it costs a million dollars. If you can see this up close, you'd be like, oh my God, I gotta have it, I gotta have it. And it, but it has matching earrings. Are these real diamonds? Go ahead, Siobhan. Are these real diamonds? They're not real diamonds, they're Swarovski, they're Swarovski diamonds, all right? So Swarovski crystals, but they look just like real diamonds. Yes. So as I said, these are the littles, all right? This is our XO, this is our golden angel, this is our angel wings. This is the hand. Um, this is the autism piece, the puzzle piece. Um, rose gold is really popular. Then we have faith, hope, and love, which is made, made for our um, first responders, all right, this year in the pandemic. Then we have our double tiny cross. We have our flip-flop, the gold and silver flip-flop. looks like real diamonds, right, Siobhan? Yes, well, I was going to ask then, uh, you. And you, you said the layered look. Are they all different? uh lengths and that's how you would wear them oh yeah are, are they all adjustable? different all of them adjust to 15 to 18 inches so it's just it just, get the heck out oh, yeah 15 to 18 inches what what's the last yep. one so what? it just depends the last one is the um the evil eye if it I that, thought so. it off, pushes off the evil okay so for yeah, you our, see that it has the pretty blue for our greek friends and middle eastern friends um we know about that uh -huh. so th that's something we would wear and um i remember as an infant my uh, not that i re uh, well yeah i remember my mother when i was small but she told me as an infant i had to have my ears pierced to have the turquoise to keep away the evil eye um, mm -hmm. so yeah, that is really cool. So you can layer them. Exactly. And they're all about $49. Most of them on that uh, stand are $49. The most expensive one is $69. So you can layer them because if you watch, if you guys watch the stories on TV, everything is layered. They have a bunch of layers. If you guys pay attention to what's trending and what's happening. So if you want to be in style, you want to layer. All right. So that's number five. The fourth one I would love to show you guys is our little black dress collection. This is a very exclusive collection. There's only four pages in our catalog. And what's great about it is it's sterling silver, and it is the finest simulated diamond in the world, which means that you cannot tell it's not a real diamond unless you put on the scope, all right? So the first piece I'll show you is Everlasting. Oh, all right, how God. stunning is Everlasting? So beautiful, right? This is the one, one of the pieces I told you goes for $2.99. It looks just like a real diamond version that goes for $70,000. But Everlasting with us is $299. And guess what? Our special is if you spend 100 bucks, you get any other item in the catalog, 50% off. 50% off, all right? So here's another piece that matches that. It's called Everlasting Cuff, all right? I love it. It comes in small and um, medium or small and large for the tiny wrist. But it's a cuff that you, should, you open up, you close, and you put it on. How beautiful is that? That is beautiful. How much? It's just is like that? a real diamond. This one's one sixty nine. All right, but if you were to get this one, you can get everlasting that matches for fifty percent off. So this would be one hundred fifty. I just need a, a so, evening and, gown to go with it. <laughs> that's funny, Siobhan. You say that, but our jewelry is for the everyday woman. So you could wear it with an evening gown, but it absolutely looks just as fabulous with the white t-shirt and jeans. Or black really? t-shirt with some boots and jeans. Is That's, that what the young wear people jewelry are every doing day. now? T-shirts? Yes, and exactly. They are. Yep. So these are a little earrings. black dress collection. How much is that? Yes. Our, How much is that? These are forty-five bucks. They're called forty-five. They're called millionaire millionaire I club earrings. That. I always wanted a pair. You want those? Yes. Nice, and they look just like the real diamond. These are called change up, ladies and gentlemen. I see we have a gentleman online. Sorry. But these you can wear three different ways. So you can wear the diamond, you can wear the um, circle by itself, or you can wear them the way you see them here. Change up. And they have a matching necklace as well. Only $79. So and the same. other things I'll show you, the little black dress. You can you do it plain or with the circle. Oh, my God. Yes. Okay. Or just a, just a stud. But this is our biggest selling um, stud. It's called Millionaire. And they're only $45. How beautiful are they? I, Stunning, I, right? I, I so that's the... <laughs> okay that's the little black dress collection and i'll just show you my rings real quick i love the little black dress collection rings because they're still in silver since the pandemic how many times do we wash our hands a day 
5,000 times a day, right? So if you forget to take your rings off, you never have a problem. Like this is open mind. It's only $49. This looks like my real wedding bands and, and engagement ring, but it's not. It's triple glam and the center stone. Then I have, um, oh my God, Allure, which looks like a copy of Chanel. Then I have Let It Shine. And all of these rings, ladies, they look like they cost thousands. They're all under a hundred bucks. All right. And this one is actually on sale this month for $53 for our sale. So that's number two. Does anybody have any questions? I know I'm talking fast and moving really fast. I appreciate anybody? it. All right. Because I got to go to the little girl's okay. room. It's been a long afternoon. Okay. <laughs> all right. I'll move fast. So our number three seller ladies are the wrap stars and the tri wraps. My favorite color are the blues. I'm a blues yeah, girl. Yeah. All right, but look how many different colors they come in. They come in 22 colors. Wow. They're all 69 and 74 bucks. Look how beautiful they sparkle. Thank so they're great for many reasons. Again, wow. And now you can dress them up or dress them down. Now, see, and I'll I show you what one looks like. I can see wearing Go those in casual clothes. That I can see. Oh, yeah. No, even the, the little black dress collection, you definitely wear casual. So this is called the Denim Wrap Star. So what's great about these, they have 600 crystals on them. You can wear them as a headband, all right? You can, um, of course, wear them on your wrist. So they just wrap, snap, and go. And that's how you wear them, all oh, right? Doreen, 22 colors, like I said. She loves the wrap uh, bracelet. She said that's her yeah. favorite. Nice. Thanks, Doreen. So this one is actually the one they gave out in the, at the Emmy Awards in the Emmy swag bags. They've given this one out, the denim, two years in a row to the stars. So really? how beautiful. This is one of my favorites. Oh yeah, this is one of my favorites. So the, the number two seller, really quick, that's the number three seller. The number two is the Chanel's. Everybody knows Coco Chanel, right? And y'all hear my dogs. Every time I get on a Zoom call, they start that. But anyway, this is what the Chanel's look like. All right, the Chanel's, this is 37 inches. They come in 20 plus colors. This is my favorite, Aurora Boreal. Let me come close. All right, how beautiful is that? They, that comes in different colors. Nice. It comes in different colors. That's it nice. doesn't um, open, it is beautiful, right? It doesn't open and close. What's great about it is if you get this little cute converter, where is it at? There we are. All right, you can wear this different ways. So you hook this on one end, How you put it on, and you, and you close it up, and you have a whole new look, all right? So remember, they come in different colors, but you can do well, a lot. So if you like a choker, cute. like I'm a choker girl. Right, that's cute. I love chokers. You can do something like this. Right, all right? that's cute. So this is Chanel, $89, 20 something colors. And then our number one seller I'm excited about. I love, my jewelry makes me happy, y'all. I can't help it. But um, our number one seller happens to be Oprah Winfrey's favorite too. She named these her favorite things. Okay. These are our famous ice bracelets. These are the ice bracelets. What do y'all think of the ice bracelets? I'll drop that one. All right. Ice bracelets are that, our top seller. Is that one piece or are they all? Oh no. It's a bunch of different pieces. Okay, can you show just, us on your wrist what that looks yeah, like? Yeah. You're a very good so, saleswoman. Thank you. She's so I have good. on the blues. I, t I told you I love the blues. Thank you, Siobhan. Um, but these are $89 for the silver and $99 for the gold. So I have some gold over here. And the other thing I love about our jewelry ladies is you're supposed to mix metals. You know how they used to say, oh, silver, silver, gold, right, right, gold, right. rose, rose. Yeah. All right. But these are some of the golds. All right. And some of our other famous pieces. So we have so many fabulous choices that are super affordable. And we call these wrist parties. This is my wrist party today, ladies. Superwoman. That's what I look like today. But this is what I look like all the time. I told you my jewelry makes me very happy. So, um, the special, as I said, is spend 100 get any other item, 50% off. And I pulled out a couple for the holidays that I thought y'all would like. These are called our bundles. All right, so I thought this would be perfect for Christmas. You see a red wrap star. You see a red oh, ice bracelet. Yeah. And these are these are our stretchies. They only go for 30 nice. bucks. 
All right, but if you bought a wrap star and a stretchy, you get your ice bracelet for 50% off. So that's a great color for the holidays, but what else is a great color for the holidays? Oh, the green. How about beautiful greens? How pretty is that? Yeah, I like how beautiful, you right? Combine. Okay, so um, now you don't have a store, but we can order it online, correct? Yes. You can, and actually, um, I, I don't have a store, but we do home parties. Of course, we haven't done home parties since March. But we do Zoom parties now. We do fun, happy hour parties, um, merry and bright, ugly sweater parties. So those are just some of the themes that we're doing now. And I have to say they take 45 minutes to an hour. The girls love them. The hostess gets between three and $600 in free bling when she does a fun Zoom party. So and we also have... Um, Walt is on the line. Walt, ahead, what, we have a lot of female friends who, who, who need some <laughs> stocking stuffers, Walt. He stayed on, so he, he's going to buy. Yes. <laughs> All right, Walt. All right, what Walt's do you like, want, okay. Juan? What do you need me to buy you? <laughs> <laughs> Siobhan would love this extra long Chanel. I didn't show this one, but this is 119. 56 in Inches. And ladies, guess what? And Walt, guess what? When you wear extra long jewelry, it makes you look taller and it makes you look thinner. It's a proven fact. So if you want to look tall, all right, this comes way past my belly button, and you want to look thinner, you want to wear extra long pieces because they accentuate you being tall and thin. Between all you right? and Doreen, I'm going to be nice and thin for January. <laughs> well, You're going to be, that's right, you're going to be safe. Last parting words for us. Yeah, that was just wonderful. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Siobhan. The last thing I'll say is that saying in this and the saying of last is that we have an awesome last minute gift sale going on with 29 pieces that are all 50 and under. We like to call it nifty and 50, nifty, nifty and 50 or 50 and under. Good. All right. They're all $50 and under. And yep. And they books. make great. They make great stocking stuffers, all right? We also have a um, holiday gift guide if you're not sure what to do. Like, well, a lot of the men don't like to shop. They don't care to shop. They just want their wife, wives and their significant others to be happy. So and we make sparkly. it super easy with our holiday gift guide. And, and sparkly. sparkly. Exactly. Sparkly. Marie, I, <laughs> I'm anticipating in January you're going to show off your bling. Well, thank you so much, Keisha. You did a great job. You're a wonderful saleswoman. Thank you for thank joining you. us. This was very fun. I want to thank all Thanks of our for having speakers me. today uh, for joining us. And where is um, where is CJ? Are you still with us, CJ? Thank you, uh, CJ, for everything you've done for us. Yeah, take yourself off mute and. I want to thank everybody and Kathleen, thank you for joining us all day long. You've been wonderful. All our speakers are wonderful. And what I'm going to do is afterwards uh, save this and then we'll have the link available for you to post on your pages if you want. This was a first uh, endeavor. And I thank you all for joining the experiment. I hope it was a success for you. And may I wish everybody happy holidays. And CJ, do you have anything you would like to add? Nope, I'm just glad you were all here. It was fabulous having an audience. If you want to save the chat with all the information that was posted throughout the day, you just go to the little three dots at the bottom of the chat window and click on that and save chat as your choice. And you just choose where you want to save the chat. And that way you get all that information. Um, the, all of the vendors today have just been absolutely marvelous. It's, it's uh, so, such fun to watch, uh, to look at all of the different things and, and uh, think about getting them. So I hope you all have have a wonderful holiday and I, I certainly am pleased to have been part of this this holistic health fair. Thank you CJ and it was very educational and our events do attract a very very I'm gonna say grounded practitioners who are professionals who really know their stuff and really know how to do teamwork so I wanted to thank everybody and um, Wish you all a happy holiday. And Kathleen, thank you for saying it was a good information. And, and 
everything. So everybody, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart and special thank you to CJ for donating her precious time this whole afternoon. So thank you and I'm going to say goodbye and happy holidays to everybody. Thank you. Thanks everybody. Happy holidays. Happy bye -bye. holidays. Bye-bye. Bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.